Welcome to Ultimate Autographs. If you were looking for the internet's most exciting and interactive live break room, then you have come to the right place. We are opening live break mystery boxes featuring the biggest names from across the sports world every single day. If you're new to breaking with us, we can help break it down and make it as easy to understand as possible. First, head over to the live break page and look for a series that suits your interests. Most of our series will have eight spots, which represent the eight NFL divisions, but other sports breaks or mixers may vary. If you purchase one spot, that means you have a one in eight chance to win that item at an extremely discounted rate. Next, click add to cart to purchase your live break spot. Once you've completed your checkout, tune into the next available live breaks broadcast on Facebook, Twitch, or YouTube at noon, three or 6 p.m. Central Time any day of the week. As you watch, you will see your name appear on the screen when your specific break begins. Your name will go into the randomizer and will be randomized a specific amount of times based on that evening's dice roll number. Once randomization is over, the list of names of people that bought into that live break will be matched up with a specific division. If the item that is pulled from the mystery box matches your division, congratulations, you just won an incredible piece of signed memorabilia. Want to guarantee yourself an item as opposed to testing your luck? Some of the series that you see on the live break page can be purchased under the mystery box tab of our website. Those boxes could either be shipped directly to your door or open live on the air before being sent to you. While you are there, make sure to sign up for our signature points club. This exclusive club earns you points toward specific discounts, signed items, or exclusive events each and every time you buy at ultimateautographs.com. The moment you have been waiting for has come. Let's break some sign memorabilia. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Ultimate Autographs Live Break Room. I am your host, Dominic Pellegrini, alongside my producer, headliner, Robbie Lopez. It is thirst Thursday, thirsty Thursday. Thursday. We have heat in the break room, a fresh new practice squad with many headliners. We only pulled the Julius Peppers pie line, uh, pylon, excuse me, and what was the secondary? I can't remember what the secondary hit was. Josh Allen. Rex. Josh Allen on the Jaguars. So everything on that practice squad, besides that Julius Peppers pylon and the Josh Allen rep, still available. That Jalen Hurts custom, that thing is absolutely sick. We have a J.J. Watt Speed Flex. A Speed Flex for $46 could go home to you. Absolute steal of a deal we have in the break room we have one and four miguel cabrera we have akeem the dream two-time nba tra champion akeem wajwan still in the one and four along with the glove gary payton and stanley cup winner steve eiserman captain of those great detroit red wings teams of the 90s and early 2000s new we have two boxes to go in the old jersey series once we close that out we have a new jersey series won't tell you who's in the jersey series but i'll give you a hint the name of it is called love Hurts. Love Hurts. Are any players in the league with those names? I don't no. know. We have one mini left in the old series. We are selling it as a single 2450. We close that out. We have a fresh new mini series in the room. And those diamonds, Aaron Donald, Speed Flex, one of the greatest defensive players of all time. Aaron Donald just retired. He'll be in the Hall of Fame in a few short years. We got him on the speed flex into diamonds alongside Kenneth Walker III and Will Anderson. Diamond double, you get that NFC West. Donald and Walker, but no pre-fills to start the show. So let's go to the dice roll. Maybe if we roll a, someone's lucky number on the dice roll, they're like, that's it? That's my sign to get in these breaks. So let's go to the randomizer, guys. You know the drill, six or higher on the dice roll. Here we go. That's not going to get it done. Four is not going to do it. There we go. Six, even six, Robbie. There we go. Even Steven. Uh-huh. Now, let's see what we are chasing for this 3 p.m. show. We have the diamonds, the jerseys, the minis, the practice squad, the one and four, the baseball guys. Mookie Betts still out there in the baseball. Pedro Martinez, Sammy Sosa, Billy Wagner, Paul Molitor, Jim, Parma, uh, Jim Palmer, and many others. And the college, which was the chase for the last show. So here we go. Let's see what we are chasing. It is going to be the... It's looking like baseball. There you go. Baseball. Mookie Betts, Sammy Sosa still out there in the baseball series. So let me put this in. Alrighty. A little 
but a baseball, hey, 45 a spot for a single in baseball. Mookie Betts jersey, best player in baseball right now. Mookie Betts on that Dodgers jersey. So, guys, what are we feeling? Let's see what we, if we're close on anything on this break page. If we are, go through a rundown. Let's start off with a rundown. Since we do have time, we do not have any pre-fills. So it's uh, two-way on this double for the practice squad, guys. Two-way on the double. Robbie, if that closes out while I do this rundown, please let me know. I will stop, and we will do that double practice squad. But here you guys, the photo for all these headliners. Only thing pulled so far is the Julius Peppers pie line. Look, you got the Adrian Peterson, Eddie George, Daniel Tomlinson, Devontae Adams, that J.J. Watt speed flex, Matty Ice, former MVP, Matt Ryan. Michael Strahan, Mike Evans, Dak Prescott, Dan Marino. Look at that sweet custom Jalen Hurts helmet. Where's my Philly fans at? Even if you're not a Philly fan and you like to collect, this is awesome for your PC. And one of the best quarterbacks of all time, Drew Brees. Let's see if we got a video of that Jalen Hurts. Look at that thing. Ooh, speed flex. You got the visor. Man, that thing is awesome. 92 for a double, 46 for a single, guys. Look at that thing. Wow. Let's zoom in on them. Can we make this a little bigger? There we go. Wow. Even the visor looks sick. The visor, absolutely. This is, how, did Colin see this thing? I don't think so. If Colin, I can't imagine Colin's going to let this slide if, if, come on. Someone's going to take this bad boy home. Who's going to do it? That's the practice squad, guys. That series is still loaded. 33 boxes left, 16 headliners. Guys, here is the baseball, the fastball series. Oh, there's that Mookie Betts jersey, that number 50 on the Dodgers. Pedro Martinez signed Funko Pop as well. And Sammy Sosa on the signed bat. Over 500 home runs. I can't confirm if this bat is corked or not, Robbie. Oh. I don't know. That was, I had to throw a little dig at the Cubs. Sorry, Cub fans. I had to throw a little dig at a little Cub. I'm just a Sox fan. Sammy Sosa, great slugger. I mean, man, icon in Chicago, slamming Sammy. Man, Billy Wagner, one of the best closers. Paul Mauder and Jim Palmer still Practice them. squad doubles up. There you go, Robbie. Thank you very much. Practice squad double is ready for me. So you're going to have Gisela, William, Michael, Chris, Jack, and Chris Cornwell. All right, guys, you know a drill? Wait for the message. Drop me two box numbers for practice squad double number one. First two numbers I see, those are the boxes we get. If not, we will go to the wheel of pain. pain. Yeah, I was going to say wheel of pain earlier. Not so much the wheel of pain for me because the two boxes that land on were right in front of me. Yes. So, wheel of ease. But we do see box color magic in the break room, especially with all these headliners left. I know I would want to call the boxes out because I yep. want to pick my own headliner. So... I'll give you guys a couple seconds to drop me a box number. What's going on, Robbie? Glad to be back. Glad first, to be back. My first show in a week. Yeah. So on my throat, if you guys can hear me, my throat is a little sore. A Yum. little, you know, a little hoarse is the word. So trying to get my uh, voice my, back. my voice back a little bit. So Pretty good. Chris says six and twenty-seven. Thank you, Chris. Take those off the ticker. Six and twenty-six. Yes, sir. Thank you, Chris, for those two numbers. Love Hurts as a 49er fan hoping for a Love Hurts. Pretty good. <laughs> uh, what's up, JW? What's going on, John? All right, let's take your names to the randomizer. <laughs> John's still away. Appreciate you, John, as always. Still away. Oh, 27. 27, excuse 27. me. Yes. All right. Good call, Chris. My fault, buddy. So, 6 and 27. Yes. Here we go. Thank you, sir. All right. Let me correct the ticker. There we go. All right. Now, let's copy and paste and take you to the randomizer six times a day. Take you up here. There we go. I'm Gisella, William, Michael, Chris Taft, Chris Cornwell, and John. Six times, guys. Six times. Final click. There we go. 
You guys see where the randomizer puts you? I'll copy and paste and put you in your respective divisions. For the practice squad, double. Number one, series loaded with highlighters right now. Fresh. Just dropped it in the middle of Robbie's show. You all right there, Robbie? There you go. <coughs> it went down the wrong hole. <laughs> You're all good now, brother? Yeah. There you go. Six and 27. Holy moly. Start off with box number six. But first, let me tell you, Chris, Chris Taft, NFC North. Michael, the yeah. NFC South. Gisela, the NFC East. William, the NFC West. Chris Cornwell, the AFC North and the AFC South. Chris Taft, the AFC East. And Jack Sutter closes us out with AFC West. All right. I wonder if Jack Sutter's related to John Sutter. You know, when I read that at first, I thought it did say John Sutter. Because I'm <laughs> so used to seeing John Sutter. But who knows? I see Jack Sutter. Or there's a knife. Start off with box six. Practice squad, guys. Good luck. Two headliners, first two breaks. That was from headliner Robbie. Let's see right now, Robbie. Yeah. <clears throat> oh. All right. All righty. Well, Robbie, I'm sorry. Because you're going to have to get up, my friend. All right. What is it? It is the Adrian no Peterson way. Pylon. Oh, it's John Sutter's son. All right. Oh, son. Jack Sutter. And that's going to Chris Tapp. NFC North, Adrian Peterson, a Viking hit on the pylon. Pylon. I keep saying pylon. I don't know why. Pylon, pylon. Look at Adrian Peterson. Great signature. Awesome. Don't want to take this out of the bag because it's in there pretty well. Got the cer certificate of authenticity right there. Let's check out his signature. There's AP. There you go, Chris Taft. Nice W right there. Another headliner off the board in this practice squad. Guys, get in now because we're three for three on these uh, headliners. Yes, we are. Adrian Peterson. Chris Tapp. Nice hit. One of the best running backs I've ever seen. I mean, as soon as this guy, college, the NFL. In college, he was a man amongst boys in, in NFL. As soon as he was a rookie, 296 yards in a game against the Chargers. Absolute Beast all day, Adrian Peterson. I'll write this up for Chris, and then we'll open the next box in that practice squad. AP, you remember playing this guy. We're both fancy teams in the NFC North, and when you had to pay, uh, play the Vikings, your main focus was stopping Adrian Peterson. How yep. about it, Robbie? <clears throat> yes, sir. He was an absolute beast. He was supposed to be like the next Walter Payton, the way his legs were. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's definitely going to be a future Hall of Famer. Adrian Peterson, an MVP his year. I mean, it's him and Tomlinson. The two years that they had when they won MVP as running backs are two of the best years I've seen in my lifetime for running backs. Awesome, awesome hit for Chris right there. Let's open the second box of this practice squad. One to go in that mini. One to go in that last mini, and then we're going to be dropping that next mini ring chasing. Ring chaser. There we go. Yeah, we got the uh, the... Graphic, so it's just being ready to drop. There we go. Ring chasing coming up next for those minis. One spot to go. It is a single box, guys. So you see the price? $24.50. It's only one box. We have one box left in the old series. So there we go. Practice squad. Box number 27. Got a feeling it's another headliner. Could be. <laughs> I mean, right now. Let's hope so, Robbie. Let's see it. Devontae Adams jersey coming out. Uh, this looks like a Ooh, mini. A mini. So it's going to be. Let's see what it is. Let's see. see. Got a couple of secondary minis out uh -huh. there. Let's see what we have here. Get the card out. Okay. 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 Yeah. All righty. We have ourselves. Secondary headliner, no Warren Sapp wow. on the Tampa Bay Bucks Mini going up. Michael with the NFC South. Nice hit, Michael. Warren Sapp. Wow. Hey, we are we are headlining. It's hot with headliners right it now. It's hot put with the headliners, fire. There, right? put the, there you go. I forgot the fire the first time. Let's get the fire now. There you go. <laughs> nice hit, Michael. Warren Sapp, a Super Bowl champion, a Hall of Famer on the Bucks. 
mean, those Bucks defenses in the early 2000s, they were lights out. Won him a Super Bowl against the Raiders. Warren Sapp, he was the best player on that defense. An absolute beast. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Former. And we got uh, Tony Gonzalez to close out that mini for us. So There you go. Thank you, Tony. All right, got the... Oh. As soon as I get this up and going, I'll go ahead and get that next minis dropped for you folks. Appreciate you, Robbie. There you go, Michael. Warren set. I love these Bucks helmets. The Creams, Coles, and the pewter ones. Yes. There you go. Let's see this thing. Nice hit. <clears throat> so there we go. Two head. That practice squad. We pulled two of your show, two headliners. The two we pulled two headliners. We're banning a thousand with these headliners in the practice squad. Yes, we squad. are. Yes, so now, it's, now it's time again. She's like, hey, man, I want that LT uh, authentic, the Tomlinson LT. That's how you see my age. You always know someone's age. If it's LT, it's a Tomlinson, you're like, okay, you know, he's, you know, 20s, maybe early 30s. If, you know, you're a little older, your LT is Lawrence Taylor. So That's true. My LT that I saw was Daniel Tomlinson. No, thank you. Thank you for playing. So that mini is coming up. Roughing the passer mini. That's a good call because we just had a guy who... You know, Warren Sapp, I won't say he's known for getting flagged for roughing a passer, but he roughed off some quarterbacks in his day. So let's move on to that mini single, which we know what box we're going to take, because it is a, uh, the last box of that. So let's copy and paste and put you guys in the randomizer. Because uh, let's see what the last box number is. It's going to be box... 30. 30. <clears throat> so let me go and the next and series is out of 25. 25. So let me put that up on the ticker, guys. Here we go. The last box of the Roughing the Passer series. Box 30 of 30. The last box. So let me update the ticker, guys, and put that new series up, which will be out of 25. All right, so let's put it, the randomizer up. Here we go. I have Troy, Pat, Jim, Jay, and Tony. Six times, guys. Final click. There you go. See where the randomizer puts you. We'll copy and paste, put you in your divisions. Roughing the passer mini. What you talking about, Wilkes? Copy and paste this again. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Let me see if that matches up. Jay, yep. Troy, yep. Pat, yep. Troy again, yep. All right. That's good. That one looks better. All righty, guys. I have Jay in the NFC North, Troy in the NFC South, Pat in the NFC East, Troy, NFC West, and the AFC North, Jim in the AFC South, Pat the AFC East, and Tony. Closing us out in the AFC West. So here we go. The last box of Roughing the Passer. Box 30 of 30. Who's it going to be, Robbie? It's an and more. We always like the and more section. Always full of surprises. The hidden gems. Always full of guys that we look at each other like, they could have been a headliner. They definitely could have been a headliner. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're going to like this one, Robbie. Well. Because it is your tight end on your oh, right. Chicago Bears. Nice. It is Cole Komet. Cole Komet. Going to Jay McGowan with the NFC North hit. There you go, Jay. Cole Komet. Nice year, Cole Komet. Got that extension. And people are like, hmm, you know. It's like, ha, huh, I can't, you know, I a little surprised that he got extended. Boom. Last year, he really, he had a nice year. Really nice year for Cole Komet. Notre Dame guy. You know Notre Dame. Not as Iowa type tight end heavy, mm -hmm. but Notre Dame got, you know. They got some good ones. They got some good tight ends as well. Nice hit. Hey, never know. Next year, he might build upon his other strong year because he's got a new quarterback yep. coming in next year. He's got himself Caleb Williams coming into town. Jay Patrick with the fire emojis. There you go, Jay. I'm guessing Jay Patrick is Jay McGowan. Nice hit, Jay. You got yourself Cole Komet. 
the Bears tight end. You excited, Robbie? You got the draft coming up in a few weeks. Oh, yeah. Your Bears are finally having, you're going to get their franchise quarterback. These guys got some weapons. You have Keenan Allen, DJ Moore, Cole Komet. Now you got some running backs, DeAndre Swift. There you go. Nice pull. There you go, Jay. Now they can get into that next mini. Now you can get into that next I, I, I pulled a U. <laughs> I forgot to put the A in it happen- there. <laughs> hey, it happens. It happens. <laughs> I was like, why is this sold out already? Oh, yeah. wait, I forgot to put the... I pulled the... <laughs> pulled it down. Hey, when you see heat, <laughs> yeah, when you see that you got heat, you're so excited for everyone yeah. else to see it yes. that sometimes yeah. you forget, all right? <laughs> it happens. Don't worry about it. A nice hit, Jay. Cole Komet. You know me, man. They always, the universe always playing tricks on me. I'm a Packer fan, so all, I always pull the Bears. All the Bears? All the Bears players. And Minnesota? And, yeah, just pull the, the Detroit Lions? Uh-huh. No Packers. <laughs> no Packers. <laughs> all right, guys, what do we want to break next? Oh, let me see that. I got to check out that new mini myself because that is a fresh new mini, Robbie, and yeah. I don't even know what's in that bad boy yet. So let's see. Let's go through a quick rundown of what we have on the break page today. I cannot wait till I get my voice back. I sound like my voice is cracking. Every time I go louder, it just sounds like my voice is cracking. All right. Here is that break page, guys. We're going through. Let's check out the minis, those new minis. There it is. Oh, these things. I like these. Check it out. Joe Theismann, a former MVP. He's even got the inscription on there. 83 MVP and a Super Bowl winner. Earl Campbell, there we go. Got Randall Cunningham. Debo Samuel on that Niners flash. John Wells, I know John Wells, a Niner fan. He's going to like that. Tony Dorsett, I love that. Look at his signature. Talk about having a nice signature. There you go. Deion Sanders, prime time on that Cowboys flash helmet. Jalen Hurts again, Robbie. It's a Jalen Hurts heavy type of room today. Yep. Hurts so good. We got TJ Hawkinson on that Vikings mini. AJ Green on the Bengals. And... Roger Craig, hey, 1,000-yard rushing, 1,000-yard receiving, Roger Craig. That's a nice hit on that Niner Lunar. Secondary headliners, Chris Johnson, Fred Taylor, Nico Collins, and Boomer Esiason for those new minis. Why we did the minis? Okay. We have two jerseys left. They are both bonus bangers, so we close out those jerseys just like the minis. New series comes in. That series, Love Hurts. Hurts. Hmm. Love hurts. What if there's any quarterbacks with those names in the NFL? Probably not. I mean, we do, you know, we got a guy, you know, in the practice squad named Hurts. We got a guy in the mini named Hurts. Hmm. There we go. There's the guy. Let's go through it just a rundown of the. Uh, what do we have in the college as well? The college is seven boxes left in the college. Headliners available that Jerome Bettis authentic helmet. A Notre Dame. Authentic helmet. When you're talking about iconic helmets in college football, you're talking about Notre Dame, the Golden Domer, <laughs> with that Jerome Bettis. And Robbie, I'm with you. You said it earlier, and I agree with you. His signature, awesome. Yes. An awesome, awesome signature. Also for the college, a secondary hit available, Jim Kelly. We already pulled the Bills Jim Kelly helmet. Can we pull the U, the Miami Hurricane? I don't usually chase many helmets. Maybe I'll give him a shot. Hey, John, there you go. Give him a shot. Here's the baseball, guys. The baseball talked about it earlier. Mookie Betts, Pedro Martinez, Sammy Sosa, still available from the photo headliner list. I would be chasing Mookie Betts. He is the best player in baseball today, an absolute star. The Dodgers put this guy all over the field. It doesn't matter. He's the best player. Two years ago, he was a center fielder. Last year, he was a second baseman. This year, he's a shortstop. And guess what? He's still the best player in baseball Mookie Betts. Got the Pedro Funko Pop, one of the best pitchers of all time, Pedro Martinez, and a 500 home run guy, Sammy Sosa. We all know the kind of the iconic home run chase between him and Mark McGuire in the 90s. That's when baseball was awesome. Yes. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> also, closer Billy Wagner. Got a great hitter in Paul Molitor and a little better pitcher. How about some Jim Palmer? We got a little bit of everything in this baseball series. There it is, guys. Practice squad. We're three-way on the practice squad, guys. Three-way on the double for the practice squad. Eddie George, the Danny Tomlinson, Devontae Adams, 
The J.J. Watt Speed Flex, still available. Matty Ice, Matt Ryan, former MVP Matt Ryan, authentic helmet. Michael Strahan, Mike Evans, Dak Prescott, Dan the Man Marino, Jalen Hurts, that beautiful custom Speed Flex, and Drew Brees. Two to go now in the practice squad. Two double. to go. Two to go on that practice squad, guys. We have Alva Kamara still available, and Phil Sims. Where's my Giants fans out? Phil Sims, the best completion percentage in the Super Bowl mm -hmm. of all time. The Diamonds, like we said earlier, Aaron Donald, the only photo headliner left, but it's a speed flex. Aaron Donald, one of the greatest defensive players of all time, one of only three guys to ever win Defensive Player of the Year three times. Lawrence Taylor, J.J. Watt, whose speed flex is available in the practice squad, and Aaron Donald. So we have two of those guys, speed flexes, one in the practice squad, one in the diamond. Come on, guys. Take advantage of these awesome deals. Secondary headliners available in the diamonds. Kendra Walker III and Will Anderson, defensive rookie of the year, Will Anderson. Houston Texans, man. Their future is going to be absolutely bright. Just, got, go. just got Stephon Diggs. And the 1-4 and four series, guys. Photo headliner still available. How about a triple crown winner, Miguel Cabrera? Oh, yes. How about a two-time NBA Finals champion and a former MVP, Akeem Olajuwon? Oh, Gary Payton, the glove, and Steve Eiserman in the one and four. There we go. One and four, absolutely loaded. 14 boxes left, four headliners. I love the one and four. Always oh, yes, great I stuff did. to come out of the one and four. Everything could be a headliner, but unfortunately, got to, you know, can't call everything a headliner. But the one and four, you can make the case for that. Jerseys, like I said earlier, we have two jerseys left till we get to the new series, but they are bonus bangers. So guys, let's see, refresh the page, see what we are close on. The closest we are at. Run away in the double box uh, practice squad. There we go. I'll drop that link in the chat. And that should close soon. So if you're thinking about getting that practice squad, you see that Jalen Hurts speed flex. It's like, oh yeah, I want that bad boy. Mm -hmm. Get into it now. That thing is absolutely sick. Practice squad, 46 for a single, 92 for a double. The value is absolutely there. I mean, you know how speed flexes, speed flexes are a ton. You get one for 46, you get one for 92, you're straight stealing from us. I don't know how, <laughs> how are we still in business with those prices? I don't either. I don't know. I do not know. But who's going to close? But hey, they're, they're good prices for them. Absolutely. <laughs> That's all, my, all, all it matters to me is we're taking care of our VIP, our very important people. And there's our big winner from the 12 o'clock show, Pat Rich. Pat Rich. Using a lot. I'm, I'm sure he's using these uh, gift cards that he got over the 12 o'clock. He won both the chases over $100 for yep. his gift card money. What's going on, Pat Rich? Welcome back. Closed it out in that double box practice squad and getting in the single one, too, now. There you go, P. Rich. Shout out you, man. All right. I don't think this guy's done. Oh, no. So that practice squad double is ready. Or closed? Excuse no, me. it's closed. Yeah, it's closed cool. out. I'll get the message ready. Drop me two box numbers for practice squad double. Number two, if you were in that break and in that break alone, drop me two numbers. First two numbers I see, those will be the boxes we get. Give you guys a couple seconds. If not, go to the wheel of pain. Twelve and twenty-one from William McPherson. Thank you, William. Appreciate you. Take those numbers off the ticker for you. Twelve and twenty-one. All righty, ticker's updated. I see it's ready. There you go. Thank you, Robbie. Mm -hmm. Troy, Chris, Gisela, William. Tony and Pat. All righty. Let's take you guys to the randomizer six times. All right. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Hopefully the rando is your friend today. Final click. There we go. You guys see where the randomizer puts you? I'll copy and paste and put you in your divisions. Twelve and twenty-one. Thank you, sir. All righty, I have Gisela in the NFC North, Pat Rich in the NFC South, Chris in the NFC East, Tony Gonzalez in the NFC West, Troy 
in the AFC North and the AFC South, Chris in the AFC East, and William McPherson in the AFC West. Thank you, Robbie. Mm -hmm. We'll start off with box number 12 in the practice squad series. Second double of the show. Here we go. Good luck, guys. That was another double box, so now it's on the 26. Oh no, 29. 29. All righty. We do our have a Hall of Famer. It is a Hall of Famer, and it is going to be. Newsome on the Cleveland Browns jersey going to Troy with the AFC North, a Hall of Fame tight end, Ozzy Newsome. Nice hit, Troy, on the custom Browns jersey. See the signature? There you go. It's got the Hall of Fame inscription. Now, my, you know, a little before my time, Ozzy Newsome, but I do remember Ozzy Newsome as a great, great general manager of the Baltimore Ravens. So he's a Hall of Famer as a tight end, and he's going to be a Hall of Famer as a general manager. So two time Hall of Famer. Ozzie Newsome. There you go. Nice hit, Troy. A little tight end. Hall of Famer. There you go. That was where in the practice squad. Oh, not even headliner. Could wow. be, right? Could be. He's a Hall wow. of Fame tight end. Yeah, Ozzie Newsome. Great name. Great jersey. Shocked he's not in that headliner category. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yep. That is going to be JSA certified as well for you, Troy. Nice hit. Ozzie Newsome. I mean, hey, things like, hey, I can't get a, you know, if you're not going to get a headliner, get a Hall of Famer is the next best thing. Yeah, pretty much. All right. Nice hit, Troy. Ozzie Newsome. Now let's get to box 21 for the practice squad. Double number two. It's going to be another Hall of Famer. No. Back to back? Oh, I'm asking you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wondering. Can he be another Hall of Famer? I think so. Let's see. Oh, you said it, Robbie. You called it. It is another Hall of Famer, and it's the original 88 on the Cowboys. It is Drew Pearson. You have the Hall of Fame inscriptions. See it right there, the Hall of Fame 21. It wow. is a rep. But, hey, these Cowboys helmets are nice. They're historic. It's a Cowboys helmet. Oh, Drew yeah. Pearson, the 88. Nice hit. Finally. He finally got in the Hall of Fame. He deserved it for a long, long time. They finally put him in. Nice hit. That's going to Chris Taft in the NFC East. Two Hall of Famers. Two and more sec That's two and more sections, but hey, Drew Pearson, Ozzie Newsome. Nice hit. There's that, John C. Nice. There you go. We know you, hey, if you're not a Cowboy fan, there's a lot of Cowboy fans out there that are willing, willing oh, to trade yeah. for you with their All Cowboy the memorabilia. We, we, get, we get them every day mm -hmm. in the break room. So there's another double, but hey, that Speed Flex still out there? Yeah. That Jalen Hurts custom Speed Flex still out there? Any of the, the three bat headliners left in the baseball? The headliners left in the baseball, Ryan, the Mookie Betts jersey, the Pedro Martinez Funko Pop, the Sammy Sosa bat, and the secondary headliners are Billy Wagner, Paul Molitor, and Jim Palmer. So those are the headliners for the baseball, Ryan. Write this up for Chris. Robbie. You. My man. Yes. You ready for an alley -oop? Uh, Give me one second. All right. I got you on that one second. I got you. Where's, uh, I got this John with a nice, but you know, I'm usually when we pull out a cowboy, our guy William Manor. Bust out with the, the nice. He loves his cowboys. Yes, he does. What now? Now I, I, for that alley-oop and the slam dunk. You know what I'm talking about, my man. 
You know what I'm talking about. Let, let our... He likes to let me do this because I'm so good at it. The Thirsty Thursday promo, everybody. I hope everybody... Someone almost had it. They bought in four breaks. If they only had bought in one more break, they could have gotten a free jersey spot. Uh, that was Mr. Jay McCowan. So, Jay McCowan, if you're listening still, we have a promo called Thirsty Thursday. It's... For every five breaks you get into, you get a free jersey spot with that six spot. So basically, you can buy any five breaks in the break room. Be sure you're putting them all in the same cart because that's how it works. It will not work if you do it individually. It only works if you put them all in the same cart. Then going over to the jersey spot, select the jersey spot. And then when you go and check out, you'll see that you're getting that jersey, a free jersey spot when you go ahead and check out. So that is how the Thirsty Thursday promo works. Hopefully you guys are out there utilizing. Again, Jay McCowan had bought four items. If he had bought one more, he could have had himself a free jersey. Looks like Troy had bought himself three breaks. If he would have spent two more, could have gotten himself a free jersey spot. So just want to throw that out there for you guys to so make sure you use them, uh, utilizing that promo today mm -hmm. already seen hey we already got three spots filled out for that practice squad number three double so if you're thinking about getting in that double for that practice squad you better get in quick because it's already starting to fill five spots remaining for that let's get in and you know what robbie you know what i'm gonna do what are you gonna do there buddy because i love the one and four so much i'm gonna add the one and four also as a chase for the baseball help our guy jj help our guy pat rich They've been in that break for a while, all yeah. day waiting. Yep. Let's give them a little sign up. We'll throw it in as the chase for today, along with the baseball, that one and four, guys. I'm telling you, the one and four, awesome, awesome series. Fan of baseball, basketball, football, hockey. I mean, there's some great hockey stuff, obviously. Steve Eisman photo. But many more always creeping in that and more section. And if you're a fan of entertainment, you see it right there on the photo. I mean, those headliners have been pulled, but you never know what other entertainment... Uh, and more bonus bangers are creeping in that one and four. Because I'm just looking at that. I mean, that was so cool. Mm -hmm. You have the Undertaker Funko yep. Pop that was already pulled. The Undertaker made an appearance at WrestleMania. Yes, Chokes, he did. Choke slammed the rock. Yes, so that he was did. cool. And I was happy. Absolutely. So I'll make that one and four also. Suggestion for Thirst there. Have a dollar amount threshold for an upgrade to like a free diamond single instead of the jerseys. There you go. There you Always go. taking suggestions. Always taking suggestions. Doesn't hurt. Let's close out, guys. Let's close out a series quick. That practice squad is it is getting balled in. So we're halfway on that one and four double. We're so, also two spots away from our uh, single box baseball mixer. There you go. Two so, spots to go in that baseball mixer. Are you saying that we're two spots away from someone having a chance to get a Mookie Betts jersey for $45? The best player in baseball today. Yes. Mookie Betts. He's a World Series champion on Boston. He's a World Series champion on the Dodgers. And this guy is awesome. Yes, he awesome. is. My He's favorite. already starting off on a good career, too. So. A uh, good season. Uh, I mean, a yeah. uh, good season is Absolutely. what I meant to say. Absolutely. He is raking. Everyone thought he was going to be... It's going to be a slow start for Mookie because he's got to learn a new position. He's playing shortstop mm -hmm. for the first time this year. Nah, he was just a natural-born hitter. Mookie Betts, my favorite player to watch in baseball. That is for $45, absolute steal. Oh, yes, it is. So what are we going to close out next, guys? What are you feeling? Who's in the chat? We're four away on the minis, the new minis. See all these guys. Check it out. Bring up this photo. All these headliners still available in the minis, guys. All of them still available. This is a fresh new mini series. We just closed out the old one. Now we have ring chasing. Oh. I kind of get the, I don't know, get got some, yeah, got Deion Sanders. No, he's a champion. Yep. Got Joe Theismann. He won a Super Bowl. There you go. Well, look Roger at Kirk that. Super Bowl. I want to throw it out there. Darcy Standish utilizing that Thirsty Thursday promo. She bought five spots in that jersey, and she's getting the sixth one for free. So she's getting six spots in that jersey. There you go. Hey, it's not Darcy's first rodeo. She knows how, she knows what to do in the break room. She knows how to play. She takes advantage of all the deals. Shout out to you, Darcy. Yeah, because she closed it out. Closing it out. There you go. You got one more box left in the uh, jerseys. Oh, one more to go? Yeah, because she closed it out with those six spots. Oh, yeah, box. Okay, I thought you said spot. One more spot to go. You're right, yeah. So we have that jersey. If you were in that jersey break, 
Is it just Darcy, or do we have anyone? Darcy, else? Jay McCowan, uh, McGowan, and Chris Cornwell. All right. So there's two boxes. So <laughs> drop me a box number for a jersey. Number one. Two boxes are 21 and 24. Two. So the first one I see, that'll be the box that we do. 21 or 24, guys. If no number, I'll put it in the randomizer, the top number after six clicks. There you are. 24 says Darcy. Thank you, Darcy. Appreciate you. If you buy six jersey spots, one of the six spots will be free. Suggestion, if you're going to buy six jersey spots with the six one of them being free, buy all eight spots in a break. One of them will be free and will be guaranteed to win in the jersey if you put, there you go. You know, one of them for free and two other people buying each spot could be lucky and win that jersey. Absolutely right, Bob. Getting six spots, you might as well close out and get yourself a guaranteed W. So I'm sure she probably would have done that, but the two already were already That's in there. Oh, so. yeah. Sure. All righty, here we go. Chris, Jay, Darcy, six times. Good luck. Final clip. There you go. You guys see where the randomizer puts you? I'll copy and paste and put you in your divisions for powder blue number one. All righty, Darcy, NFC North and the NFC South. Chris, the NFC East. Darcy, the NFC West, the AFC North, and the AFC South. Jay, the AFC East. And Darcy, closing us out with the AFC West. We go box 24 powder blue one more box like robbie said and then we have a new jersey series in the room love hurts all right what a hall of famer venus williams there you go, on the Cardinal jersey. Remember him on the Cardinals? Remember him on the yes. Rams? Great cornerback in his day. Going to Darcy with the NFC West. There you go, Darcy. You get the signature in there. Nice hit. Wow. Mm-hmm. Wow. Great, great cornerback in his day. I caught on late to Williams. He was already on the Rams when I started watching football. And he was a beast on the Rams as well. He's on the Cardinals. So nice hit. A Hall of Fame corner. You know, think of those Rams. I know he's the Cardinal right here, but you know, those Rams teams were so good. You think about the offenses all the time. But he was a mainstay in that defense. Nice hit, Darcy. Nice hit. Hey, using that Thursday Thursday. Six spots. There you go. Description. Is that the? Is that a Bible passage? Romans ten nine nine, on there. That's a cool little inscription. Nice. Yeah, that's a pretty cool one. Mm -hmm. Pulled that one out a couple weeks ago. Yeah, he was a beast. Ball hawk. Nice hit, Darcy. Nice hit. Now one more jersey to go in the powder blue series. And then we get the new series in the break room. Love hurts. Love hurts. There you go. Love sucks. Robbie's a little heartbro heartbroken singing the love hurts. <laughs> Don't do this to me. Is that the passage, Bob? There you go. Bob knows the passage. The only Bible passage I know from heart is Austin 316. That's the only one I know. That's the only one you know? Yes. By heart. Write this up for Darcy, her W, in the powder blue jersey. There you go. So what do you guys want to feel? What do you guys want to break next? Probably going to be that practice squad. Probably getting close to filling up that practice squad. 
There we go. Let me write this up for Darcy. See where, where we're at. Let's refresh this page. See if I need to drop a link in the chat for us. Because I got a feeling we're close. Yeah, four away on the practice squad double, guys. I'll drop that link in the chat. Let's get that closed out. All right. So some heat, hey, nice start to the show already, 345, pulling out some great, great memorabilia, but still, I'm seeing authentic helmets available in that practice squad, the Dan Marino, yeah. Eddie George, the J.J. Watt Speed Flex, we got the LaDalian Tomlinson, that Matt Ryan, Matty Ice authentic, any Falcons fans in here? Any Falcons, Jalen Hurts, for who's running that Austin who's stone cold, will pile and drive the first. <laughs> I hope not. Hey, I'm a Stone Cold fan. He better not power drive me. All right? That's my guy. I'm a little disappointed I didn't see him on Sunday at WrestleMania, but hey, The Undertaker was there, who we have sometimes Yeah, they in the were break saying room. that Undertaker was supposed to be coming now. Or uh, Stone Cold was supposed to come and save Cody Rhodes, but it was The Undertaker. Mm-hmm. The dead man. Right. William Loesch closing out that fastball baseball mixer. There you go, William. There you go, William. I mean, Sammy Sosa, Mookie Betts. Come on, forty-five dollars. You have a chance for? Why not? All right, let's get that out of the way. Let's get that baseball ready for you guys. Let's close out this jersey. There we go. You say double or single? I'm sorry. Single. Right? Single. Thank you, sir. So get that message ready. Baseball. Where you going? There it is. If you're in that baseball break, drop me a box number for baseball number one. Fastball. There you go for you, sir. Thank you, sir. Fastball number one. Yep, guys there. Yeah, Mookie Betts. Yeah, he can take care of a fastball. Sammy Sosa, we've seen him hit, hit a few fastballs out. We have Travis with box seven. Thank you, Travis. They're over here, Robbie. I'll get those, okay? You got it, boss. You got it. Update the ticker. Thank you, Travis. Box seven. The Tim Anderson box number. There you go. Box seven and fastball. Baseball mixer. Let's take the six names and put you guys in the randomizer six times. All right, here we go. Final click. There it is. You guys see where the randomizer puts you? Let's copy and paste and put you in your baseball divisions. All right, Gisela, American League East, Jay, the AL Central, William, the AL West, Ryan, the NL East, Jack, the NL Central, and Travis, the NL West. Travis has that... Uh, Mookie bet spot. He's hoping his box color magic is working right now. So here we go. Box number seven in baseball. What's up, Pat? What's going on? <laughs> What's it's, up, Pat? Travis goes, here we go. Has to be the bets. Yep. Let's see who it is. It's light. Light as a feather. Mm. Yes, sir. It is going to be a 500 home run hitter, Rafael Palmero on the Texas Rangers custom jersey. It's going to go to William Loach with an American League West hit. That's a nice custom jersey. And even has the inscription on how many home runs Palmero had. If you look closely... See it right there? 569 home runs. Ooh. I was I used to watch this guy when I was a kid. He used to hit a lot of home runs. I remember him. He had a sweet mustache. Yeah, he did. Yeah, absolutely sweet mustache. William Loesch. One of the best. Mm -hmm. Didn't William close out that series? I think so. The baseball. There you go, William. Baseball? A little closer magic. 
Rafael Palmero, former Cub, former obviously a former Ranger. He was a former Ranger a couple times, but yeah. also a former Oriole. So nice hit. William Loesch to close it out. Absolutely. Rafael Palmero, 569 home runs. And if you take his word from it, he did not use steroids. Yes, he did. Well, I'm just saying his I mean, words. no, he didn't. I'm just saying his words on the stand. I know. That was just his words on the stand. Um, did, they, did they ever find him in contempt? I don't think so. I think, okay. yeah. Nice hit. It is also JSA certified. Nice hit. <laughs> Custom is nice as the Fanatics being used today. Yeah, so I watched the clip the other day. I forgot what player. He slid in the home. And his pants ripped. These uh, Fanatics jerseys are not a... Already? They're not a hit. They're not a hit. No. The, the uniforms... Because uh, the theme is, is like... Um, At least with the... Fanatics is not even on the... Is not the one to blame because they're the ones that manufacture. It's, it's Nike that took the blame for it. They're the ones that botched on these uniforms. Yeah. And now they're trying to blame MLB, saying that, that you know, because they are the ones that have proved it, it shouldn't mm-hmm. be their fault for approving it. Absolutely. See how I spell Rafael Palmero. So, two to go in that next double box practice uh, practice squad. Two to go in that one. Uh, we're f- three to go in that single box. Two to go in the one and four. Hey, one and four is the chase. One and four is the chase as well. And then four to go in that fa- uh, baseball mixer double box. There you go. And uh, back to that Fanatics. The custom jerseys, it seems like it fills out the back of the jersey. The numbers are bigger and the names are bigger. It actually fills out the jersey. A lot of these new jerseys, the numbers are so tiny, the names are so tiny, where it looks like they're wearing like a, a kid's jersey kind yeah. of. I don't know. Uh, it's supposed to help with their performance on the field, but I haven't uh, heard the players say performance. Too. My butt. I think Nike was just being too cheap. Well, they hey. didn't want to pay for the room and all that, and they're being cheap with the with the with the clothing. There you go, Rafael Paul Nero. Goes down on the next double box. Power uh, practice squad, so that's coming up next. There we go. That practice squad double coming up. That's going to be practice squad three Number double. Three. Number three. So I'll put that in the chat for us. Drop me two box numbers. You guys love that practice squad, and why not? Hey, 46 for a single, 92 for a double. When there's speed flexes, there's authentics in there. Yep. Absolutely. You got MVPs like Matty Ice, like Danny Tomlinson, Jalen Hurts, who... You know, Jalen Hurts came so close to winning the Super Bowl against Kansas City. That was one of the best games I've seen a quarterback play in a Super Bowl game. He was lights out in that game. But drop me. Oh, too many numbers. What's up, David? Familia. What's going on, brother? Hey, it's David. David, how was WrestleMania? David, go. Oh, you watch? I wonder if you watch. I didn't get to watch oh. it live. I was oh. on vacation, so I did not get to watch it live. I mean, they didn't have it at the in Las Vegas. They did not have. No, they believe it or not, they did not have uh, wrestling wow. on at the sports book. Whoever's in that practice squad three got you right here. Troy, Chris, Gisela, Pat. Two numbers for that practice squad. Number three. You would think so, you know. Fanatics will be the official supplier of jerseys for the NHL next year, replacing Adidas. We'll see if they screw them up like they and Nike did with the MLB. Who is that? The Fanatics are going to be the supplier for the NHL, so hopefully the numbers are not tiny and the names actually fit. Well, Fanatics is is pretty much the main distributor now because, you know, Fanatics just bought everything. Yeah. So they've gotten their hands into everything. Behave, behave, David. Please behave. (laughs) What is he saying? What is he saying? (laughs) Hey, hey! I'll give you, I'll give you, uh, like the ninety, uh, Johnny Sins of the Break Room, Lumberjack '90s thug. Dude's got, the dude's yeah, done it all. It's a WrestleMania was good. We'll worry about that one. <laughs> <That's> good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There we go. By waiting for two numbers, two numbers for the practice squad. Now we'll go to the wheel. 
Hey, David, I'm I'm a guy of many disguises. You know? Mm-hmm, yeah. The lumberjack. You got a lot of gimmicks, man. You're always switching it up. Sins. You're like Chris Jericho. Chris Jericho always switched. You, you got to switch go, up the yeah. gimmick. You know, it can't be stale. Can't. I, I'm a little mad, David. My guy lost, Roman Reigns. Yes. Uh, I'm a Cody Rhodes guy. I'm, I, I like the bloodline. I'm so glad. Who's got me two numbers? Troy, Chris, Pat, Gisela. I'll give you guys about a couple seconds, and then we go to the wheel. To the wheel. You don't want to go... I mean, the wheel was good last week, or the last hour. Mm-hmm. So, who knows? Maybe it might be good for them. The wheel out of 35. Let's refresh. All right, guys. As soon as I put up this wheel, any box number is invalid. So, there it is. All right, Robbie. Let's see what box. Oh, this is one. Let's go to one out of where's the one out of thirty-five. This is there. This is out of thirty. I just saw the one out of thirty-five. Did I click out of it? No, keep going. Oh, I think you did. And I clicked out. I'll get it up. Give me one second. Let me get that wheel thirty-five up. Uh, who was that? Oh, that was JJ Jones. See, Robbie, I get excited, man. We're talking about yeah. wrestling. We got the practice squad. Going crazy in the break room. And JJ Jones is starting off that double box practice squad, getting one spot in there. There we go. So JJ's kicking off that double box practice squad. Uh, let's see where else. Still four away down that fastball baseball mixer double box. Two to go now in that practice squad single box. Two to go in the practice squad single. All right. Okay, this says out of... Well, this says out of 30, guys, but you see there's 35 in there right now. So let's go. Let's spin it and see what we have. Mick Foley do love Cactus Jack and Mankind. There you go, Bob. There you go. Okay. All yeah, right, Mick guys. Mick Foley was great. We're spinning the wheel to see the practice squad double number three. That dude is another legend, uh, a legendary wrestler. Absolutely. Go with 35. 35. All right. Let's take that off the ticker. We know we have 35. In the practice? In the practice. We talk about practice, Robbie. We talk Robbie. about practice? We talk about practice. Let's see what the next number will be. We have 35, and the next one will be 8. Let's check the ticker. I think we have 8. Uh, we do not have no 8. Wait. I got nine or seven. All right, let's go to, let's put nine and seven in the randomizer. What was the first one? 35 was the first one. Seven and nine, top number of this one, it's going to be this box, guys. Box nine, Robbie. Box nine. Nine? Nine and 35, my friend. Nine. Thank you, sir. All right, now let's copy and paste. Let's go back to this randomizer and put the names in here. Troy, Chris, Gisela, and Pat. Here we go, guys, six times. Final click. There it is. Let's put you guys in your divisions. All righty, I got Pat in the NFC North, Chris in the NFC South, Troy in the NFC East, Pat, NFC West in the AFC North, Chris, the AFC South, Gisela, the AFC East, and Pat, the AFC West. There you go. Let's not forget Mr. Sacco, absolutely. Mr. Mr. Sacco! The Mandible Claw. Ooh. Yes. You know, you could say wrestling's fake, and it is. I'm not going to argue it is, but it still sucks that you still have to put a man's dirty sock in your mouth that's been in his pants all day. You can't fake that. You know, that's, no, that, you can't. That's disgusting. But hey, here we go. We have box number nine. This was picked by our wheel and randomizer. So, let's get it. Hopefully the wheel. We'll see if it's a real wheel of pain or if it's the wheel of... Uh, Luck. Luck, yeah, there we go. Mr. Sacco! <laughs> Let's see what we have here, Robbie. Ooh. We 
got a good one. You feeling a little warm? I'm feeling hot. Feeling hot? Well, that's because there's there's a fire. fire? There's a fire happening. Oh, there's a fire happening. It's a headliner. It's a headliner. It's authentic. It's who is it? Eddie George on the Eddie Titans. George. There you go with the 1996 wow. NFL Rookie of the Year inscription. There we go. Let's extinguish that fire. Going to the AFC South. That's Chris Tapp. There you go, Chris Tapp. Eddie George, former Pro Bowl running back and Ohio State Buckeye. And a Madden cover guy. There we go. Eddie George. Yeah, he was on the Madden. Uh-huh. On the retro. The yeah, retro. that's the retro ones. Mm-hmm. Titans helmet. There you go. An authentic helmet off the board. Come on now. That's the Prag Squad, baby. Yeah, it is. There you go, Chris. Eddie George. Chris. Nice hit right there. Hey, Chris. Uh, second win of the show, I believe, for Chris. Uh, Chris who? Chris Taft? Chris Taft? Yeah, got the Adrian Peterson on the uh, pylon. There you go, two headliners for Chris Taft. And he's got the Drew Pearson mm. in the other pra uh, practice squad double. There you go, Chris. Have yourself, a, yeah. have yourself a night, Chris. Eddie George, you get Adrian what, Peterson. What did William Loesch get in that fastball? Oh, uh, Rafael Palmeiro. Rafael. Got Josh, yeah, the Josh Allen uh, Flash. Man, I love those Jaguars yeah. Flash helmets, Chris. Those are awesome. You got the whole AFC South, my man. Eddie George, got Josh Allen. There we go. All right, box 35. Now, this was picked by the wheel as well. Let's see what we have in box 35. Practice squad, Eddie George. We have another authentic coming out of here, Robbie. I don't know. I, I, I kind of had a sense it was going to be a good one. Mm -hmm. We're going to pull nothing but heat from these practice squads right now. Yes, we have. And it's just going to continue to get better mm -hmm. as we go along. This one, uh oh. It's getting a little warm in here again, Robbie. Uh oh. It's getting a little warm again. I'll say it. Let's see who we have in box 35. Oh. Ooh. You know what? No, you can't do the fire. Because you know what? We're going to put this fire out with a little bit of Matty Ice. Matty Matt Ice. Ryan. Wow, another authentic. Going to, guess who that's going to? Chris Taft no with the way. NFC South. Chris Taft, have yourself a day, my man. Ooh, Matty Ice, Matt Ryan. Wow. He's got the MVP inscription. It's a little blue. See if you can see it. Got to get it. There you go. 2016 NFL MVP. That Atlanta offense that year absolutely lights out. We all know what happened. We're not going to talk yes. about what happened in the Super Bowl. We're not going to bring it up. But Matt Ryan was lights out that year. Deserved that MVP. And that was an MVP where Tom Brady had an amazing year. Aaron Rodgers had an amazing year. This man beat them all out. Matt Ryan. Nice hit, man. Not just a former MVP as well, but he's a former Rookie of the Year, Matt Ryan. Yes, he where was. Kind of Atlanta, when he got drafted there, they were in a tough spot. This was the, after the Michael Vick situation where, you know, he went to jail. And it looked like Atlanta yeah. was, ugh, they're going to be in, you know, purgatory for a while. No, they drafted uh, Matt Ryan, went to the playoffs his first year. He was a winner. There you go. Anyone win something today they want to trade for the Warren Sat Mini Helmet? I already have the full size. If not, all good and happy to have both, says Lou. Yep, the one that Warren Sat Mini and the practice squad double. A nice hit. Chris Taft, man. Woo. Same order number. There you go, Chris. Matt Ryan and Eddie George. The headliners are keep coming out of that practice. Now's the time to get in. Now's the time to get in. Still, though, saw that Matt Ryan Authentico, the Eddie George Authentico. We still have a Dan Marino Authentic, a Ladalian Tomlinson Authentic, the Jalen Hurts Custom Speed Flex Authentic, the J.J. Watt Speed Flex. Come on, guys. Now's the time. Come on. I'll write these up for you, Chris. Man. Nice hit. Matt Ryan, very, very underrated. Awesome, awesome quarterback. And I believe... You know, he might be retired, but he's not officially. The papers are not into the NFL. Yeah. They're not into the NFL. I know he was working on the broadcast CBS, but you never know, man. 
till those till, till those papers are officially put in the NFL, can't worry about a comeback with these guys. Who is your team, Lou? I have minis I could trade out for set. There you go. Matt Ryan and Eddie George. It's the only way. The only way you can stop the headline fire, Robbie, is get a little bit of Matty Ice. Yep. That's how you cool it. But I know. I gotta imagine, Robbie, you seem busy over there. Are they still attacking that practice squad? Uh someone's getting into the minis and some other stuff. There you go. Hey. Troy Sorson. There you go. Shout out you, Troy. Thank you, buddy. That new mini series. All those headliners still available. Okay, looks like we are now down to one spot to go in that practice squad. One spot to go. One spot to go in that practice squad, guys. And five to go in the double. Five to go in the double. That's going to close quick. Those doubles close quick. Let me refresh my page. And there's William Loesch to close it out. There you go. That practice squad single coming up. I'll get the message ready. Drop me a box number four, practice squad number one. The first single of the show will be doing doubles. I'm a Giants fan, but open the trade. Anything comparable to expand collection. There you go. Hey, Lou. Got Phil Sims. Phil Sims in the practice squad. Still out there. Box five. What's up, JP? I'll wait for that one gets ready. Yeah, it's all the way in the back. I know. <laughs> I'm gonna start putting these practice squads in the front because I think <laughs> I think it's gonna be a big hit. So it takes its time when it's traveling. Yeah. <laughs> All righty, James Pago. Hey, what's up, JP? What's going on, man? I got Troy. Yep. We'll do a box five for that practice squad. Thank you, JP. Appreciate you, James. All right. Let's go to that randomizer. Six times. Six times on the rando. Good luck, everybody. You ready? Final click, Robbie. There it is. It's 49. Oh, mini. And the mini's closed. All righty. Ryan Glover closed out that mini. There you go. Shout out to you, Ryan. Here we go for the practice squad single. Pat, NFC North. William, the NFC South. Pat, the NFC East. Giselle, the NFC West. JP, the AFC North. Troy, AFC South and the AFC East. And Pat, the AFC West. Box number five. Good man. Here we go. Pull some heat. It looks like a looks like another mini helmet. Let's see who we have on this mini. We have the card. Is the card in there? Ah, all right. How about a Hall of Fame offensive lineman, Jonathan Ogden, on the Baltimore Raven Mini? There you go. You got the Hall of Fame inscription. Nice looking helmet right there. Going to JP. There you go, JP. Jonathan Ogden with the AFC North hit. Nice. Hey, you think of the Ravens, you think of like the defenses that they have with Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, Terrell Suggs. John Denogan was the mainstay of that offense. And the same draft. The same draft as Ray Lewis. Talk about, you know, GM keeping a job. And I believe the GM who drafted both of them, Ozzie Newsome. So I I, I know Ozzie Newsome was the GM. I gotta see if Ozzie Newsome was the one who drafted both of them. But they were in the same draft. Jonathan Ogden and Ray Lewis, the same round. Absolute hole of a round for the Ravens, that one. Nice hit, JP. Great lineman, absolutely. 
Hall of Famer as well. Got some protection coming your way. Protect your blind side, JP. Nice hit. We're talking about like great players, man. These linemen, they get disrespected in the break room. The linemen get disrespected because he could be a headliner. The way how how good he was. All righty. Write that up for JP. Also, my friend, JSA certified. There you go. Looks like we have the Love Hurts mini coming up after this one. Let me write this one up quick. And then we'll do the first of the new. Or the minis is called. Uh, are these the minis? Yes. Oh, the minis are called the ring chasing. Oh, I'm sorry. No, you're good. You're good. I'll go fix that real quick. You're all good. Don't worry. Love Hurts is. Yes. All right, we do have a mini coming up. It is a fresh new series. It all starts with a great offense. Absolutely. JP, you know, if you don't got an offensive line, you don't have anything. All right, there you go. Thanks, my man. JP, you're a Raiders fan, right? I believe... All right, I have John, Troy, Larry, and Ryan for the minis. I say I was in Vegas the last week. Went to a Raiders team store. Okay. Some cool, made some cool Raider stuff in there. Some really cool Raider stuff. Some Devontae Adams stuff. You know me, I love Devontae Adams. One of my favorite players in the league. Uh, Max Crosby. So it was cool. I didn't get to see the stadium, though. I no. wish I got the... I, I forgot to look for the stadium. But John, Troy, Larry, Ryan, two box numbers for mini number one. Fresh new series. All the box numbers are available. It's out of 25. That's updated for you. Yep. First numbers I see, those will be the numbers we go to. If not, we'll go to the wheel. Just gonna have that box color magic. You know, they weren't in town. I tried to look for it. They were when I was there. They were not in town because that would have been an awesome thing to do, go to. Every time I go on vacation, the teams are never in town. I go to Nashville, the Predators are not in town. Yeah. But I want to check out a game. I go to Vegas, the Vegas Knights are not in town. I got I flew back Tuesday. That was the day I flew back. Was on Tuesday. This Tuesday. I went in last Friday. I got back. I got home this Tuesday. As you can tell, my voice is a little sore. I said 24, right? Yeah, 8 and 24, yes. Thank you, Larry. I changed his name. There you go. Ring chase. Yes. All righty. Let's copy and paste and put you guys in the randomizer. Six times. Six times. I had the wheel ready, so thank you, Larry. All righty. Final click. All righty. Copy and paste. I wish I went to a Vegas Knights game. It would have saved me money because I didn't. I took in the sports book. That's what I yeah. took in. I didn't leave it. <laughs> <laughs> I was there for a while. <laughs> All righty, guys. I have Ryan Glover, the NFC North. John Sutter, the NFC South. Troy, the NFC East. Ryan, the NFC West. Larry, the AFC North. Troy, close us out with the AFC South, the AFC East, and the AFC West. Good luck to everybody. Ring chasing number one. Boxes eight and 24. Called out by Larry. Larry has the AFC North. That's a good spot. 
Oh, good spot right now. We'll start off with box number eight. Watch for Deontay Cox this year, uh, combine from Seller, Illinois, Salukis. Wide receiver headed to NFL, my nephew. There we go. We'll watch out. I used to, uh, I had a buddy who went to Southern Illinois. I used to take trips up there. Carbondale, Saluki. Definitely watch out for that. Good luck to your nephew. All right, let's see what we have in ring chasing. Number one. Let's get a, a headliner. There he is. We do have a headliner. It is the man himself, Jalen Hurts, Philadelphia Eagle quarterback. Ooh, first, hey, get the fire. There's the fire. Look at that. There's a the headliner. That's going to Troy with the NFC East. Nice hit, Troy, man. Jalen Hurts, stud. Stud quarterback on the Eagles. Nice. We know our guy Colin in the break room. He loves that helmet. There we go. Hey, Jalen Hurts coming out in the minis. Does that mean, is that could possibly a sign that he wants to come out for the practice squad? Because that's B-Flex. That thing's a must-have. A must-have. I'll write this out for you, Troy. Then we'll open the second box of ring chasing. Was, <laughs> Was there one? Was there an OJ helmet in this here, in the room? I don't think there's an OJ helmet. We have none in the room right now. No OJ helmets in the room right now, according to our board. According to our headliner board. Write this up for Troy. Jalen Hurts. He had one of those games in the Super Bowl where, for all my hockey fans out there, I call it a Jean Sebastian Jaguar game, where, yeah, your team loses, but you played great. Played awesome. That's what he had. He was awesome in that Super Bowl. Dimes all. Anytime says Jalen Hurts, one-year wonder, uh-uh. You don't have a one-year wonder and show out in a Super Bowl like this man did. And he was great last year. Banged up towards the end of the year. Had a knee problem. Eagles will be back next year. And this man's going to lead the charge. Jalen Hurts. No way. The They pulled the headliner from the mini already? Oh, you know it. It's a headliner. You know. Wow. Robbie, if you're in the room, you know there's headliners coming out. They don't call you well, headliner Robbie. I guess custom. I guess the uh, that means Jalen Hurts custom is going to be coming out. That's what I said. Could be a sign that the Jalen Hurts custom might be ready to come out. Nice hit, Troy. Indeed, says Pat. Absolutely. Or the Jalen Hurts jersey. Well, we still got to close out that. Uh... Oh, I'm sorry. That's right. <laughs> I spoiled it. Dang it. Who was that? That was uh, Minis, right? All right, here we go. Box 24. Ring chasing. Oh, that was the first box, too. Here we go. I'm not moving. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to stay right here. In the college football. Oh, I believe he was pulled already in the college. Yeah, that OJ was pulled already in the college, Taylor. Yes. Okay. This is a nice one. I think you're good. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Here's, ooh, this is nice. We have ourselves. Dante Culpepper, ooh. former quarterback on the Minnesota Vikings. Another Madden cover guy, yeah. just like Eddie George. There you go. Going to Ryan Glover with the nice. NFC North. Dante Culpepper. Nice hit, my man. Wow. This, I hate to say it. I hate to say it. I don't like to say anything nice about Vikings. But it's a great looking helmet. It is. Awesome looking lid. And Dante Culpepper was an awesome quarterback. Had a lot of fun watching him when I was younger. This man threw Syracuse. bombs. Bombs. Dante Culpepper. Absolute stud. Was all Randy Moss is up. No, thank you, Ryan. Thank you. This man used to throw bombs to Randy Moss. So a nice hit right there. Dante Culpepper. Mike was looking for a, a new quarterback this offseason. Yeah. Unless they, you know, the content we're going with Sam Darnold as their starting quarterback next year. The speculation is that they're going to trade up in the draft to get a quarterback, which... J.J. McCarthy. Yeah, J.J. McCarthy, which makes sense because they did get an extra first-round pick from Houston, yep. which is a sign that Buffalo did a few years back when they got Josh Allen. 
try to get that extra first round pick so they can trade that extra first round pick so they can move up in the draft. I believe their picks right now are 11 and 23. Who? For Minnesota? Uh, 20. 20 and... Is it 20? I believe it was 20. They got like a 20th pick and uh, you said 13 or... 11 and... 11, 11 and 23? Let me, I'm going to double check right now. Yeah. I, I believe it is a 20th pick. So the Vikings... Draft picks for this year. And they hold the... So they hold the eleventh overall pick, mm -hmm. and the twenty third overall pick, I believe. It. And yes, the twenty third overall pick. I was gonna say number forty two, but that went to Houston. Yes. And they acquired the twenty third overall. Yes. Pick. So, you know, Minnesota might be trading up for a quarterback. They hope he's as good as Dante Culpepper. At least has a live arm like Culpepper. Man. So I think right now that's what their their trade package. With I possibly another player to be thrown in there for the Chargers for that number fifth pick. So they're giving up the eleventh, the twenty third, and possible a player to be named for that fifth. Is that a good trade package for that fifth rounder? If I'm the Chargers, it all depends who's there for me. If Marvin Harrison Jr. is there at number five. Keep your trade package. I want Marvin Harrison Jr. and Justin Herbert on the same team together. Ooh. That slides out. If Marvin Harrison Jr. is gone at number five, if, say, Arizona, they pick him at four, then I, I would consider that. But I need, I don't need they're, more than the 11 and 23. I want a second, they're and I want a first more on more likely year. not to go wide receiver. I think they're more likely to go and get uh, Notre Dame's offensive tackle. They, they so need, they need the, the offensive help to yep. keep – Justin Herbert's upright. Absolutely. So I, I, I mean, I mean, they, this team's got so much too because they traded uh, Keenan Allen to us. They lost Mike Williams. They lost Austin Eckler. So they've got a lot of holes to fill. Keenan Allen was on my flight to Vegas. Get out of here! I swear. No. Way. Nobody believes me. Keenan Allen was on my flight to Vegas. Did you sit next to him? I sat in fr behind him. I know it was Keenan Allen. I 100 percent knew it was Keenan Allen, and I even looked as soon as I landed. I got on my phone. I checked Keenan Allen's Instagram. So he just posted. As soon as we landed, like an hour later, he posted that he was in Las Vegas. He goes, just landed in Las Vegas. I go, I knew it. I was on the same plane as Keenan Allen. Damn. I was. Yes. So. That's that's Well, first off, I'm sorry. I'm the guy who would be like waiting for him to get off the plane. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm like, hey, Keenan, I'm from Chicago. I was, to, I, was to me. I was too excited to be in Vegas. So I was like, you know what? I'm not going to go interrupt this Bears player of all people. No Bears player. Maybe, if, you know, if it was Jordan Love, you know, I would have I been like, yo, what's up, Jay Love? Keenan Allen, I can't talk to the enemy. That's the enemy. Uh, I right. guess you got to think. Yeah, it's true. It's That's, true. Well, while we have time, let's go through a quick run, rundown of what we have on the break page. Here we go, guys. See, there's four, uh, four spots left for the practice squad. Number four. We have that Dan Marino Authentic still available. The Devontae Adams jersey still available. The Drew Brees rep, one of the best quarterbacks of all time. How about a speed flex? J.J. Watt's speed flex? How about that custom speed flex at Jalen Hurts? I'll show you the video, guys, shortly. Mike Evans all, uh, rep. We've got a LaDainian Thompson Authentic. Michael Strahan, Dak Prescott. Those are both reps. And in the secondary headliner list, Alvin Kamara rep. And a Phil Sims man. Let's get a video of this Jalen Hurts. I can't believe that's... That thing is nasty. Look at that thing. Man, wait till Colin sees this thing. Mm. We gotta make sure he wow. doesn't gotta make sure he doesn't drool all over this. This is guy. This is it's guy. Got, this is his team. This is a sick helmet. I mean, it's got the words hurt so bad. Or hurt so good. Mm. Right there on the visor. Hurt so good. That thing. And it's even a signed visor. Yeah. Double signatures on this helmet that is awesome look at that thing guys wow that is just nasty i've never seen a helmet like this it could be yours getting a single 46 dollars. you want to close up the double 92 absolute steal of a helmet in that practice squad guys Take oh it it's a one out of one i just saw that one did you see that let's see let's get it again one out of one let's check this thing's a limited one out of one it's going to be right on the bottom next to the air hole on this coming up side right here you'll see it right there boom 
See, pause. There you go. One out of one. Am I not? Am I right? Is that his number? It could be. Is that a signature? I don't know. I think that says limited edition one out of one. All right. One slash one. All yeah. All righty. Hey, awesome looking helmet. Oh, Nevertheless, wow. that thing is absolutely sick. How about some baseball? We're three slots to go in this baseball. We're halfway there. Mookie Betts jersey still out there. Pedro Martinez Funko Pop slamming Sammy Sosa signed bat. Robbie says there's no cork in it. I don't know. No cork. No cork. No cork. No cork in the slam and Sammy bag. How about a little bit of closer magic? Billy Wagner. Mm -hmm. There we go. Paul Molitor and Jim Palmer still available in the baseball mixer as well. We're halfway there, guys. Here's the college. Here's the college. Where's the, there's the OJ that Taylor was asking about earlier. But that, that one's gone. But the uh, headliners available for the college. That Jerome Bass authentic. Notre Dame, man. There's no more iconic helmet in football, college football, than the Golden Domer itself. Notre Dame and that beautiful, beautiful Jerome Bettis signature. Got to love the guy who takes time, you know, you know, take puts an effort in the signing this. Yes, and there's very few. I mean, look at Tim Brown, his guy, uh, former guy, or another player from Notre Dame. Tim Brown's got another signature that's absolutely beautiful too. Mm -hmm. Drop a quick pick. You mean Link, Pat? You mean Link? Oh, yeah. Let me know he, if you mean he, Lincoln for which one. I'll yeah. drop a link. I'll drop one for baseball and for the practice squad, just in case for you. Unless you meant college, I'll drop one for the college, too, my man. There you go, Link. I got you, Pat. You want, I'll drop one for the college. Just sorry to fill. Sorry to clog everyone's uh, feet. Ch chat. Chat feed. But there we go. That's the college secondary headliner available in that college. Jim Kelly, University of Miami. Here's the Divins. We have another speed flex. Aaron Donald speed flex. One of the best defensive players of all time. And when I say one of the best defensive players of all time, I'm not saying one of the best 25, one of the best 15. I'm saying one of the best three mm -hmm. of all time. I say Lawrence Taylor, Reggie White, Aaron Donald, three of the best defensive players of all time. And you could throw maybe fourth guy in there, J.J. Watt, because there's only three guys that ever win Defensive Player of the Year three times. We have two of them in the break room yep. right now. J.J. Watt, Speed Flex, Aaron Donald, Speed Flex. We got Speed Flexes, guys, in the break room. Aaron Donald could be yours. Come on. 184 double, 94 single, secondary headliner available. Kenneth Walker to third, and 2024 rookie Defensive Player of the Year, Will Anderson. The one and four, also the chase today, guys. We're a halfway to double break. We have Miguel Cabrera, the bat, Mr. Triple Crown himself. I used to watch this guy a lot in the American League Central. Mm -hmm. One of the best hitters I've ever seen. Akeem Olajuwon, two-time NBA champion. 94-95 champ on the Houston Rockets, a former MVP. One of the best big men of all time. More basketball in the secondary headliners. The glove, Gary Payton, one of the best perimeter defenders of all time. A Hall of Famer on the Seattle Super Hot, uh, Supersonics. And how about some hockey? Steve Eiserman, Detroit Red Wing, signed photo. That's the one of four, man. You got some hockey, baseball, you got everything. Entertainment, sports, it's a great series, guys. There's the practice squad. There's the new mini helmets. This is the fresh new mini helmet. The Jalen Hurts has been pulled, but everyone else still available. Theismann, Campbell, Cunningham, Samuel, Dorsett, Primetime, Hawkinson, A.J. Green, and Roger Craig available in the minis. We have one box left for the jerseys. It's a bonus banger. It's from the Ann Moore section. We close out that jersey. We have the new jersey series titled Love Hurts. Won't tell you who's in there. You can solve that yourself. Love Hurts. So guys, what do we want to break next? Let's see. Refresh the page. It is another practice squad double box. It's going to be another practice squad double box. There we go. Shout out you guys. Closing that out. I'll get that message ready in the chat. Got me two box numbers. And then we're like one away from the college double box. All right, draw me two box numbers for practice squad number four. Numbers, not numbers. Noimbers. 
first two numbers I see. Who do I have in that break? I got JJ, I got Giselle, I got Troy, I got Michael, I got William, I got Pat. Who's going to drop me those two numbers? Who's going to get a little box color magic for the practice squad? Double number four. Give you guys a couple seconds. If not, we go to the wheel. As soon as that wheel comes up on the screen, don't have to go to the wheel. William said, I'll take 17 and three. I got you, William. Thank you, buddy. 17 and three. Let me take that off the ticker. Gotcha. All right, I'll get those, Robbie. They're right here. So one to go in that uh, baseball double box mixer, two to go in that one and four double box mixer, three to go in that one and four double box mixer, and those are the closest ones to go. There you go. Thank you, Robbie. All right. We got the boxes. So let's take you guys to the randomizer. Copy and paste your names. Six times. Six times around the world. Around the world, around the world, around the world, around the world. I like that song because I know all the words. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a uh, repeater, you know? Uh-huh. Six times, guys. Six times. Final click. There we go. Copy and paste this. I'll take you to your football divisions. All righty. I have Gisela, NFC North. Pat, the NFC South. JJ, the NFC East, Gisela, the NFC West, Troy, the AFC North, William, the AFC South, Michael, the AFC East, and Pat, the AFC West. We will start with box number three in the practice squad double. Number four. Four. Around the world. Now, now that's stuck in my head. I know. I know. That's what happens when I, that's what happens. When I'm up at 2 a.m. saying that in my head, I'm calling you. Hey, screaming. you better call, you call me, you I'm, son of a... I'm you, calling you, you know. <laughs> Get on, you got PlayStation? <laughs> I can't go to bed now. <laughs> All right. We have ourselves a jersey. And it's going to be another running back. Fred Jackson on the Buffalo Bills going to Michael with the AFC East. Fred Jackson, Mr. Dependable, I used to call this guy. He's have on my fantasy team a lot. He, he was good. Awesome. Awesome hit right there. Buffalo Bills running back Fred Jackson. For Taylor's in the minis. Mm -hmm. This guy was dependable, Fred Jackson. That's an AFC East hit, Michael. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Michael slash Lou. Fred nice hit. Fred Jackson. Action Jackson. Action Jackson. Absolutely. Nice hit right there. Fred Jackson. Way. There we go. Number 22. Nice hit, Michael. Nice hit. Also, there you go. GSA, sir. Absolutely. Absolutely, my friend. Fred Jackson. Yeah, we got to let him know that it's a cert card because there's a lot of people out there <clears throat> don't like to mention names, but, you know. What? <laughs> that went over my head. I don't know. Oh, they like to say, you know, is, is it a cert card? Is it New Beckett? Does it, it looks like. We'll let you know. I got you. Here we go. Box 17. Practice squad out of 35. But yeah, word is that GSA is now going QR code now. Really? Yeah, yeah. everyone's starting to go QR cards. So you're not going to see a lot of these cert cards anymore. Same Back in you're obviously not seeing too many of them because they went to the cert card or uh, uh, QR code. And then word is uh, that GSA is in the process of doing the same, and so is uh, PSA. I like the QR code. It's easier, less paper. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. I don't. We don't see this guy too often in the break room. Ooh. A former Pro Bowler, tight end. Let me turn it yeah. around. Yeah. Todd Heap. I was gonna say Todd Heap. On the Baltimore Ravens. We don't see him a lot in the break room. That's the first time I'm seeing him. Yeah, Todd Heaton. Wow. Former tight end. Nice hit. This is going to Troy with the AFC North. Nice hit, Troy. Todd nice Heaton. hit. Man, talk about, you know, just like Jonathan Ogden, one of the mainstays of the Ravens' offenses. 
I mean, that, those two guys were really the only mainstays because it was a revolving door for all offenses. We yes. knew the Ravens' defense. It was Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, and many guys. But, you know, John Dodgen on the line, Todd Heap, tight end, you know, he protected as well. Oh, yeah. Nice hit, man. Troy, beautiful hit on the oh, beautiful goodness. Ravens' custom jersey. Did not expect that. No, nah, that's a nice hit right that's there. That's a surprise hit. I told you, hidden gems. I'm going to start using this term, man, because I, I like it's, a, it's it's perfect. I like I it. I mean, hidden gems are just coming out left and right. Mm -hmm. Awesome hit right there. Todd Heat, man. Who would have thought he would be in this practice squad? Here we go. Also, here you go, Robbie. JSA certified. Todd Heat. Booyah. Nice hit right there. Going to Troy Sorsen, AFC North. Couple jerseys. Couple of jerseys this break for the practice squad. Those speed flexes, though, still out there. As much as I love these jerseys, Robbie, oh. we know what the stake of this meal is. It's so speed flexes. Oh, all I gotta say is please continue to get in the practice squad double box because it's 4:35. We literally maybe have 25 minutes left to, to stay on because we gotta let the six o'clock crew on. But I do not want the six o'clock crew to pull out that Jalen Hurts. I want me and Dom to pull it out right here, uh -oh. right now, for you guys. That way you don't have to worry about when the 6 o'clock traffic comes. Because there's a lot of traffic comes in here at 6 o'clock. And I'm telling you right now, you won't have a chance at getting it. Since it's kind of died down a little bit now, this is the perfect chance to get in there right now. Whether it be you or someone else or two other people that takes a couple spots here and there. Here's your chance to take it home right now, then have to wait when these big time guys come out at six o'clock. I'll tell you what though, if, you, if that Jalen Hurts gets pulled to six p.m. show, I cannot guarantee that helmet does not come with drool because our Colin, yes. he loves the Eagles. Is he gonna be here tonight? Yeah, he loves his Eagles. Oh, that's right. He loves Jalen Hurts. I know for a fact he's gonna love looking at that. Okay, so we want to open it now. We don't want. Common or uh, Colin to open this up. I want to open it right now. So that way when they come in, I'll be like, Colin, look what we just opened up right here in front of everybody. <laughs> the Jalen Hurts Custom. Don't go. let these guys have all the fun at 6 o'clock. I want to have some of the fun here. Absolutely. And I'd say, still a lot of fun to have in that practice while that Dan Marino, even Dan Marino offense. Yeah, still, Dan Marino offense. Dan the man, one of the best quarterbacks of all The J.J. Time. Watt speed flex. Mm -hmm. Looks like Josh Underwood's getting in here. Larry Jensen got in that double box practice squad, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. Who's going to want to join them? Already two spots filled out for that. We are one spot away from that double Baseball, guys. Mm -hmm. One spot away from double baseball. Who's going to get their chance at getting a Mookie Betts autograph jersey? The best player in baseball today, Mookie Betts. Hey, if you don't want Mookie, how about one of the best pitchers of all time? Pedro Martinez, a Cy Young Award winner, World Series champion. Pedro's a man. I used to love watching Pedro when he was on the Red Sox. Yes. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And you got slamming Sammy. I mean, that was a guy you were kind of like... I wouldn't say I used to love watching Sammy Sosa. I was jealous watching Sammy Sosa as a kid. I was like, man, I wish he was on the White Sox. Very fun player to watch. Hit a home run, do a little hop. And then we get to go back in the dugout. What was the thing in the dugout? He would do, boom, boom. He do that little thing oh, yeah. in the dugout. Sammy oh, yeah. Sosa, fun player to watch. And secondary hits in that baseball. Billy Wagner, one of the best closers of all time. Paul Molitor, baseball Hall of Famer. And Jim Palmer, another Hall of Famer. So, fun fact. Sammy Sosa was on the White Sox. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. He was. Uh, he looked like he was a. Uh, when he was on the White Sox, he was looked very big. He was a lot skinnier. Yes, than he was, was when he was on yes. the Cubs. But he was on the White Sox. Yes, he was. Yep. And the. Uh, I actually got him on the White Sox card. Do you? Nice. Yes. There you go. Yep. Got an old. Well, I believe what was that? Nineteen nineties. Yeah. Right. Early nineties. Early nineties. Yeah. Because I believe he's. <sighs> Tops. Started out as te he was like with Texas for a while. Yeah, not a while, not a while, for like a um, year. And then he went to the Sox. He got drafted by the Texas or by Texas Rangers. Then he went to the White Sox, and then obviously the Cubs. Let's look it up for Sammy Sosa. We definitely, obviously, know Sammy Sosa is a Chicago Cub. But yeah, I don't. I think he was on the Sox for maybe a couple years. Uh, for yeah, for a so, couple yep. years, three years. Oh, I'm sorry, up. I forgot. Baltimore, 
He finished up in uh, Baltimore for that one year. That's right. Yeah, we got we got the pre juice, JJ. We were the pre juice. <laughs> he, he was twenty one when he was on the Sox. So he was on Texas when he was twenty. The Sox when he was twenty one, and we traded him to the Cubs when he was twenty three years old. Then he yeah. spent his last uh, last couple years with uh, had one year with Baltimore, and then he finished his career with Texas. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Yeah, because yeah. it says right here he took the two thousand six year off, and then ended a career in two thousand eight two thousand nine. Mm-hmm. Pretty gnarly. Six hundred and nine career home runs. Wow. For slamming Sammy Sosa. Wow. An MVP, seven-time All Star, home run derby champ, a six-time Silver Slugger, and who? An MLB Player of the Year. So fun to watch back then. He's a Hall of Famer, but they won't put him in because of the fact you know. Some of I these, wonder why. Uh, you know the 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 when that whole era was going through the the uh, Congress hearing and everything, they had the opportunity to come clean. And some of them chose to plead the fifth, which, you know, hey, they have the right to. But it, it, at the same time, it kind of makes you feel like they're guilty. Mm-hmm. That's how I kind of took it. I mean, either way, Sammy Sosa, he was a baseball icon. Make no mistake about it. Especially in the Chicagoland area. 600 home runs. Just needs to... <laughs> That's true, JJ. I mean, if they, they should just all let him in at this point. Let them all in. Just hard to talk about baseball. Oh, yeah. You talk about a baseball Hall of Fame, and you don't have Barry Bonds in there. You don't have Slam- Sammy Sosa and McGuire. It's hard not to talk about that Rafael era of baseball. Palmero. Yeah, Palmero. Yep. Making its own wing up with you, JJ. Let's see where we are on this break page. Still, if we are. I know we're still one away on that baseball. Who's going to close it out for that baseball, guys? Six away on the practice squad. Double number five. Will Juki. Starts that last jersey box break, buying two spots. So he's got six more to go to close that out. We're done with that jersey, and we'll be able to drop that Love Hurts jersey break coming up right after these powder blue ones. There you go. Hey, Robbie, you said it. You know, we're getting closer to signing off, you know. Yep. Baseball's the chase, and the one of four. We're one away in the baseball. Get your name in the chase, not once, twice, because we're one away filling out that double. Yes. And you have a chance of winning up to $100 in ultimate autograph gift card money. You win 100 bucks, you put it in the practice squad, put it in the diamonds, and you home, go home with a speed flex mm-hmm. for free practically. Yep. For free. Exactly. So who's going to take advantage of those sweet deals? And Robbie. Elio. 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 Let him know about Slim Thursday, up. Thursday. Thursday. Which was pretty cool because Darcy Standish used that. Mm -hmm. So thank you, Darcy, for utilizing that Thirsty Thursday promo. But anybody interested in buying five or more breaks, five or more, uh, you get a six-spot jersey spot for free on us. So basically how it works is you put all five of those breaks in the same cart. Then selecting over to the jersey, you go ahead and select the jersey spot. You'll get that at the checkout. You'll see that it'll be zeroed out for free. So all you're basically paying is for five breaks, getting that free jersey spot for free, and who knows? We fill up that jerseys, we knock it out, and whatever breaks you buy into, you never know. You're going to you know, go home away with a few of those uh, wins, and then uh, you may get a shot, a shot at a free jersey, too. Absolutely. Thank and you, And it's Bob. a bonus banger, bonus or banger. hidden gem, as I like to say. There you go. You're the Blake Griffin of my Chris Paul, Lob City, my man. Yeah, and it uh, looks like uh, Pat Rich said we had enough. I had enough of that. Mm-hmm. We well, just closed it out. Closed out that last uh, or the uh, college or baseball baseball mm-hmm. double box is what I'm trying to say. All right, that message is in there. Chad dropped me two box numbers for baseball double number one. I would love to see that Mookie Betts jersey come out. Mookie is the man. My favorite, just a fun player to watch right now in baseball. A throwback. An absolute throwback. There it is right here. So drop me two box numbers. Get a little box color magic. Hopefully, if you want that Mookie, if you're a Red Sox guy, you want that Pedro Martinez. I mean, if you're a couple... Funko Pops are starting to be very, very popular. Uh, across every break room, I'm seeing them everywhere. These Funko Pops are something that are just very unique items to start as a class. I have uh, a whole collection started with Doug... From Nickelodeon, nice. Uh, a couple of uh, Disney. You got Skeeter. Uh, I got Skeeter. I got you got Doug. Uh, you got Roger. I got Roger. That little punk uh, uh, dog. Patty. Pork chop the dog. Pork chop the dog. Nice. There you go. It's pretty cool. I love him. Roger. Yeah, Roger cool. was like the little punk on that show. Yeah. With the leather. I liked yeah. him. Yeah. Yeah. He was Roger was my guy. Yeah. Uh, I see a four and fourteen first. 
Oh, JJ just beat Pat by zero. Well, point zero one second. Ooh, four and fourteen. Four and right. fourteen for the baseball. For the baseball. Thank you, JJ. Thank you, Pat, as well. All right, let's take you guys to the randomizer six times. Six names, six times the randomizer. I have a Batman Funko Pop collection. Ooh. So every Batman Funko Pop I try to get. There you go. I saw a really cool autograph Robert Pants and Batman Funko Pop, and I was like, I need to get that one day. <laughs> Some cool stuff. Oh, yeah. But here we go, guys. Six times in the randomizer. Final click. There we go. All right, you guys see where the randomizer put you? Let's take you to our baseball divisions. All righty, Pat, American League East, Jay, the AL Central, Brandon, the AL West, JJ, the NL East, Gisela, close out with the NL Central and the NL West. Maybe if you ask Santa. That's true. Well, that means I got to be good this year, William. Ah, who wants to do that? <laughs> who wants to be good for a whole year? Come on, Marlon said, hey. There you go. You a Marlins fan, JJ? I've been in their stadium before. The year after they won the World Series in 04, I went to the their old stadium. I think it was Jack Ruby at the time, or Joe Ruby, whatever the name was, with the orange sheets. I was It was me and my uncle. We were like the only people in there. I couldn't believe it. It was a year oh. after they won the World Series. Wow. But I always liked the Marlins. I always liked their uniforms. Yeah. And they beat the Cubs in 03, so go Marlins. Hey, hey, hey. What? What? A little too soon, man. Here you go. Hey, you got my guy, JJ, you got my guy, Jake Berger and Tim Anderson. Jake Berger can hit. Here we go. Yes, he can. Box number four for fastball. Oh, I always say if if Tim Anderson has a great year with Miami this year, it just goes to show you that he was not happy with the White Sox. I'm rooting for Tim Anderson. He was a fun player to watch with the Sox. Obviously, the ending wasn't so great. Struggled near the end. But some of the best moments of the Sox that I've seen live, the, the Field of Dreams game, where okay. he hit that walk-off home run. Yep. That's in my, that was awesome. Awesome as a White Sox fan. So Tim Anderson, that's my guy for life. Jake Berger, awesome hitter on the Marlins right now. There you go, JJ. Go Marlins. Let's see what we have here. Ooh. Ooh. This is awesome. Oh! We have ourselves a... That's a gold glove? It's a signed gold glove. I don't want to take it out of its packaging. If you guys can see it, it's Wade Boggs. Wade oh, wow. Boggs. Which, if you know Wade Boggs, he's a Red Sox, he's a Yankee, he's a Devil Ray. So it's American League East. That's going to Pat yes. Rich. I don't want. I want them to see if they can see the signature. There you go, Tim Anderson. Yeah, well, I got a Tim Anderson jersey. So there you go. But Wade Boggs, one of the best hitters of baseball. Hall of Famer. You said Rick, Pat Rich, AL East? Yes, sir. That is sick. Yeah, the gold glove, man. This is awesome. Weight box. A mini gold glove. Kind of like, yeah, a mini helmet. We got yeah. mini gold gloves. That's awesome, man. Yeah, see, let me see that. Yeah. That thing is pretty The legend about wow. Wade Boggs that before the games, he would eat a bucket of chicken and drink a case of beer. I got to say, that is nice, nice, nice. Nice. Robbie, we were just talking about this before the show about baseball players, how nowadays you have these guys, you know, they got the six packs, they got the muscles, and they're always getting hurt running the first base. Yep. You got a guy like Wade Box who was pregame meals, a bucket of chicken and some beer, and this guy was you couldn't get him off the baseball field. Nope. No sorry. I should be we should get in the nutrition game for baseball. <laughs> like, you're, eat, you're eating chicken and you're drinking beer before the games. Yes. That's it. You're doing Wade Boggs Day. Or or the, or the guy from uh, Cleveland Indians movie um, where he's doing a sacrifice. Pedro Serrano? Uh, Pedro Serrano. Oh, yeah, and they have to get, uh, they couldn't they find get, a live chicken. They, a, so they, got, they, yeah. get, they get a bucket chicken. Yes. <laughs> if you want to talk about one of my favorite movies of all time, Major League. Major League Baseball I love is my favorite. Major League. That movie makes me laugh. Oh, every time. Yes. <laughs> Wild oh. thing. 
Oh man, that's, Ricky that Vaughn. was one of the best. Oh yeah. Oh man. Where Wesley I? Snipes in that. Willie Mays Hayes, yeah. Willie Mays Hayes. Pedro Serrano was the Allstate guy. He used to do the commercials. That's all. I remember. No way. Yes. That's Mark, him. Dennis Haysbert, I believe his name is. Get out of yes. here. Yes. That's only like I know he was on the tw- I think he was on the show twenty four. I really don't watch show twenty four. The only things I ever seen him was the oh commercials. Oh my god! It does not look like him. Uh huh. There we go. But hey, guys. Fourteen. I love one. That's a great movie. I even like the second a, one. Yeah, it is. The second one's got. I love the second one. Not a lot of people like it, but third one is bad. I won't. I won't yeah. defend the third one. I, 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 I stopped after the second one. Look for me on TV at the Tampa Bay Gambaro translator for higher sign. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Let's see. What do we have there? Bob says, don't collect baseball, but that is sick. Oh, we got ourselves. There we go, Robbie. There we go. JJ <laughs> says, good thing I got that 0.1 before you, Pat. Well, <laughs> it's good for Pat because it's got he's got himself another oh, wow. W. It is Jim Palmer <laughs> oh, on wow. the Orioles custom jersey. And you guys ain't kidding. These custom jerseys. Look better than the Fanatics yes, jerseys right now. They do. Because at least they cover the back yes. of the jersey or the name and the number. There you go. That's Pat Rich again with Jim Palmer, Hall of Famer, right there. Now, I got to look up Jim Palmer's stats because I know Jim Palmer, Hall of Famer, but a little before my time. So let's check him out. Let's check him out for our guy, Pat Rich, the Baltimore Orioles. It's good to be a Baltimore fan right now. How about it? Just called up Jackson Holiday. Ooh. All right, Jim Palmer, Hall of Famer, three-time Cy Young, six-time All-Star, three-time World Series champion, four-time Gold Glove, two-time ERA champion. That'll do it. It's an absolute Hall of Fame. Oh, yeah, it is. Career right there. No doubt about it. 268 Ws. Man, Pat. The Pat Rich gets richer. Yeah, he does. There you go, Jim Palmer. Crazy cool indeed, my friend. Man. Well, hey, if you're jumping on a team right now, a bandwagon for a baseball team, Baltimore's a team. They got some young Yeah, they, talent. like you said, they just brought up their uh, number one prospect, mm-hmm. uh, Holiday. Yeah. Uh, got his first RBI yet last night. Yes, this did, guy man. is going to be a stud. I can't wait to just see him. Uh, I think the Cubs are in Baltimore. Or are they, or Baltimore comes to Chicago? Ooh. Beckett, certified, my man. There you go. There you go. Yeah, Baltimore's coming a must watch game to go to. Who would have thought that five years ago? If you said, hey, I got tickets for an Orioles game, eh, I don't want to go see the Orioles. Now it's like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that might be. You, the... you, you want to go see the Orioles. Mm-hmm. I picked Ailey Rushman to win an MVP at the beginning of the year on one of my wagers, which is now thrown out the window, Robbie, because in that same wager, I had Spencer Strider winning Cy Young, who is currently out. With so, time. Cubs head to Baltimore July 9th through the 11th. Yep. So, that's going to be a fun series to watch. Absolutely. Jackson Holiday, his draft was a few years ago. It was one of the first drafts where I was like, damn, I'm getting old as heck. Because he went number one, Matt Holiday was a dad. I remember I watched Matt Holiday's entire career. I couldn't believe it. And you know who went number two in that draft? Drew Jones, son of Andrew Jones, whose career, again, another career mm-hmm. I watched entirely. That just made, I was like, man, I am getting so old. We're now I'm watching the kids now. Yeah. The kids are the players that I grew up watching. Oh, it is, man. It is shocking. All right. Are we close on anything, Robbie? Uh, let me see. Let me check where we're at. I'm just getting a couple orders in. It looks like Dustin Rose is coming into the break room. Welcome, Dustin Rose. What's up, Dustin? He's getting three spots in that practice squad double box. So that may put us close. Believe it or not, that's going to put us at two spots to go. There we go. In the next practice squad double box. Let's close that out. Jim Palmer and Wade Boggs. What a hit for Pat Rich right there. That is, yeah, I got to say, that has got to be one hell of a hit. How cool is that gold glove? That was a That cool. was awesome. That was cool. I'm I sorry, that was going to take us three to go in that next double box. There we go. Let's refresh this page. 
All righty, guys. There it is, what we have on the break page. We're three to go in this practice squad. Go and take advantage. Those speed flexes yeah. are still available. Bob is watching grandkids of former players. That makes you feel <laughs> Uh, that does make me feel a little better, yeah. <laughs> soon, man, I hope I don't get there. I mean, Common. <laughs> I hope I don't get there anytime soon, because that's when I'm getting real old. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, man. But hey. I, I mean, Common's got a good point. I mean, I, I feel the same way. Like, we grew up watching players that are now retired, and now we're watching, like, their kids and everything. Yeah. We're like, damn. Uh -huh. Now we know what Bob feels like. <laughs> Come on now, but hey, here's the practice squad. Those speed flex is still available. The JJ Watt, the Jalen Hurts still out there. You get a single spot on the practice squad, forty six dollars, double ninety two. Either way, ninety two dollars for a speed flex. Sign me up. That's putting us out of business. Type steal. Come on, guys, take advantage of that sweet, sweet deal. The Dan Marino authentic still available. De Devontae Adams jersey, Drew Brees rep, Mike Evans rep, Ladainley Tomlinson authentic, Michael Strahan rep, Dak Prescott rep, and secondary headliners Alvin Kamara and Phil Sims still out there for the practice squad. Look, look at that sweet flash LT. I know. There you go. Oh man. Love that powder blue on those. Uh, Chargers helmets. Mm -hmm. We got JJ Jones. All right. Making it two now to go. Two to go, Ill. There you go. In that uh, practice squad five. How about some baseball? We just pulled out heat in that baseball series. How about some more? Mookie Betts is still out there, guys. The best player in baseball still out there. 45 for a single spot. $45 for a Mookie Betts jersey. Robbie. I might put in my resignation papers just so I can get in this break. I want a Mookie Betts jersey for $45. Matt, I'm on a temporary suspension. <laughs> no. I don't know what suspension. Just say leave. You can just say leave. You can just say suspension. We'll make you look better than that. But hey, Pedro Martinez signed Funko Pop. We like the Funko yes, Pop. Yes, those the are awesome. Sammy Sosa bat. Uh, 609 career home runs. Sammy Sosa. 90 bucks for a double. 45 for a single, guys. Great deals. Who's going to close it out? Just like Billy Wagner, yes. great closer, and Paul Molitor, still available in that baseball series. The college, guys, were five slots ago in the college double. The Jerome Bettis, authentic Notre Dame, Golden Domer, authentic. I mean, iconic helmet in college football. It doesn't get more iconic than the Golden Domer itself. Notre Dame, fighting Irish, and you have Jerome Bettis on that beautiful I mean, his signature is beautiful. You work with yes. Joe. If you ever worked with Joe, Robbie, before, Joe Aguilar? Oh, no. well, when you work with Joe, you start to appreciate signatures. So I'm now I keep looking at all these signatures now. Jerome Bettis, he's got a great one. Yes. And secondary headliner available, Jim Kelly from the U, University of Miami. We got the Diamonds, guys. Aaron Donald still available in the Diamonds. <laughs> Only three players have ever won Defensive Player of the Year three times. We have two of them in the break room. One's in the practice squad, J.J. Watt. The other one is in the Diamonds, Aaron Donald. They are both speed flexes. Check it out, man. One of the greatest defensive players of all time. Not even defensive players of all time. Just one of the greatest players, period, of all time. Aaron Donald, so dominant. Made that big play in the Super Bowl. Fourth down, the Bengals looking to convert to uh, extend the game. Aaron Donald bull rushes his way, causes the pressure, causes the incomplete pass to Joe Burrow. The Rams win the Super Bowl. His celebration, as soon as the play was over with, he just pointed to his ring finger. He knew yep. he was getting a ring. There we go. Secondary headliners available for the Diamonds. Kent Walker the third and Will Anderson, defensive rookie of the year, Will Anderson. Hey, Diamond Double, NFC West, Aaron Donald, Kenneth Walker. Yep. It's the way to do it. That's one to go in that practice squad double box. One to go. One to go in that practice squad double, guys. Here's the one and four. Also the chase along with the baseball today. Akeem Olajuwon, Miguel Cabrera still available from the photo headliners. We have a triple crown winner, and we have a two-time NBA champion slash former MVP as well. Also available in the secondary headliners, the glove. Gary Payton still out there, Seattle Supersonic, and captain of those Detroit Red Wings teams that won those Stanley Cups. Had that great rivalry with the Colorado Avalanche in the 90s and the early 2000s. Steve Iserman still out there. Assigned photo for Steve Iserman. But you know the drill with the 1 and 4, Robbie. It's all headliner-worthy stuff that oh, comes yeah. out of those boxes in the 1 and 4 
Here are the mini helmets, guys. We only did one break for these new minis. There's 33, excuse me, 23 of these boxes left. The Jalen Hurts is gone, but the rest of these headliners are still available. Joe Theismann, Earl Campbell, Randall Cunningham, Debo Samuel, Tony Dorsett, Primetime. Deion Sanders, that Primetime flash. I like that. I love me some Primetime. TJ Hawkinson, AJ Green, and Roger Craig still available for the minis. Secondary headliners also available. Chris Johnson, Fred Taylor, Nico Collins, and Boomer Esiason. And the jerseys, we have one box to go in the Powder Blue Series. It is a bonus banker jersey from the Ann Moore section. As soon as we close that out, we have a new jersey series ready for you. Love Hurts. You can guess what kind of quarterbacks are. Ooh, I don't want to spoil it too much, but there you go. You can guess who's in that series. So let's close out that practice squad since we are yes. one away. Oh, we close it out. Thank you, Robbie. Wait for that. Get ready. Single or double? Double. Double? Cool. Thank you. I'll get that message ready. Right, there it is for you. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. PS double. That's going to probably be our last break, too. There we go. Practice squad double number five. Well, hey, if they're still breaking. Uh, I mean, yeah. Jeremy, two box numbers for prank squad double number five. And Larry, Josh, Dustin, JJ, and Frank. First two numbers I see, those are numbers that we get. Uh, I hear Collins' voice. The practice squad double. He's getting nervous because that Eagles helmet. Yeah. He's getting nervous. I have 13 and 20 from Frank. I'll get those. Those are right here. Thank you, Frank. Let's hope. They are the good ones. 15 and 28. All right. There we go, guys. Saw Frank's numbers first, Dustin, so we're going to go with Frank's 13 and 28 right here. Saw for 13. First, let me take those off the ticker before I forget. Oh, yeah, you don't. Never want to forget that. All righty. That's updated. All right, it's copy and paste the names to take you guys to the rando. I was in Vegas. Yeah, obviously, no. Someone said the word rando, and I was like, "You talking about a randomizer?" And they're like, "What are you talking about?" I was like, "Oh, never mind. Work, work stuff. Work stuff. My mind's work, work stuff. Yeah, it's a randomizer." You talking about, huh? Someone said like, I was talking to some rando. I was like, "You're talking to a randomizer." They're like, "What?" That's too funny. Here we go. Final click. There we go. Woke you up in the middle of the sleep. What? What? Rando. <laughs> Box two. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Practice squad double number five. We have Dustin Rose in the NFC North. Frank Evans in the NFC South. JJ Jones in the NFC East. Larry Jensen in the NFC West. Josh Underwood in the AFC North. And Dustin Rose closing us out with the AFC South, the AFC East, and the AFC West. Adrenaline in my soul. Every time I see Dustin Rose's name, just reminds me of Cody Rhodes for some reason. It's not even close to the same name. But I just keep saying the Cody Rhodes theme song in my head. Adrenaline in my soul for Dustin Rhodes. So congrats, uh, not congrats, good luck to everybody. So here we go. Box 13. Practice squad double. Number five. I feel like I'm getting my boys back slowly. What you looking for? No, I was just seeing something. Alrighty. We have ourselves another jersey. It's going to be Cowboys Pro Bowl Pass Rusher. Demarcus Lawrence. There we go. Going into the NFC East. Going to J.J. Jones. There you go. Can you ship out the word? Does Bob have an order number for today's any of uh, today's shows? If Bob has an order number for any of today's show, uh, for anything for today's show, we can do that. 
If he doesn't have an order number, then you'll have to ship that out yourself, Lou. Sorry about that. There we go, Demarcus Lawrence. If uh, Bob has an order number from today, we could definitely ship that out. That's going to JJ Jones. Nice hit, JJ. Marcus Lawrence, Cowboy. You guys know I'll draw with some Cowboys. A lot of Cowboy fans out there. There you go. Absolute stud pass rusher, Demarcus Lawrence. Gotcha, Lou. Double me up with the Washington football team. There you go. Nice hit. Nice hit indeed. That, my friend, is JSA certified. Demarcus Lawrence. JJ looking to double up with the Washington helmet. There you go. Put this away. And then we got the other box for the practice squad. Double number five. They are attacking that practice squad, Robbie. We love to see it. Yes, they are. Put this away. JJ's looking for a Washington helmet. Bring back the Washington. I love the Washington football team name. I just love that name. Yes. It's just like, we're the football team. We're not going to name ourselves anything else. We're the football team. Here we go, box 28. We'll call up on Frank. Just waiting for a new practice squad double up, and I'll have an order. I thought I did that. No. Oh, it didn't redo it. No. Must Got have you, Bob. The save button. Appreciate you, Bob. You not appreciate this tape. This tape is good. Come on, tape. There we go. There you guys go. Thank you, Bob. Appreciate you. Can you make the correction in the winner sheet for the switch? What's up? Um, Lou, Michael, Atr uh, Atrondo, the Warren Sat Mini from the... Yep. He's gifting his to Bob. The uh, Warren Sat Mini to Bob. Oh, okay. So you use, right yeah, yeah. Guys, so can you ship my Warren Sat Mini to Bob? Okay. Yep. So use that so order number. Gets, uh, order number in. Yep. Just waiting on him to put an order in. All right, so we got a trade going on here today. Looks like we have a, a football. Let's see who it is. We have ourselves. Here he is again. Who? Dante Culpepper no on the way. football. Wow. Going to Dustin Rose. There you go, Dustin. He had to hear me sing about his name. Well, he's getting a winner. There you go, Dante Culpepper on the side football. Nice job, my man. JSA certified. Dante Culpepper, former quarterback, Minnesota Vikings. Nice hit. Nice hit, Indy. Thanks, guys. Got you, Bob. Want it yet? Appreciate you, Bob. Put this one away. For Dustin. Nice hit, Dustin. I told you, man. I'm always pulling Minnesota Vikings. What is yeah, yeah you are. Always pulling some Vikings. <laughs> Bob says, maybe you can ship me a winner, too. Hey. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's get it done. Right, some new orders coming in. Looks like, yep, there's Bob's number right here. Appreciate you, Bob. Dante Culpepper. All right. So let's see. It is. Let's see what where we're at right now, Robbie. Uh, I think it's a good time. We'll do the chase right now. We're pretty much yeah, open yeah, with everything yeah, else. We can do good. the chase. 
That's all set for you. All set for us. 18 people. 18 people. All right, we'll do the chase right now. We'll be back, guys, for Common and Colin for their show. We'll give them enough time to get everything ready and set up for their show. Practice squad's moving. I have the baseball right here. We tried to make the one and four. No one got in for the one and four. Nope. So it's just going to be the baseball in here. So let's copy and paste these names. And you guys know the drill. The top name after six clicks, you get a chance up to $100. Ultimate autograph gift card money. Here we go. Top name after six clicks. Here we go. It's going to be Gisela. 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 Mm -hmm. There you go. Is JJ in the next baseball double? Uh, give me one second. No problem. Take your time. He just got into the double box uh, practice squad. Practice squad, okay. Uh, baseball, you said? Yes. Baseball double? Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, sir, JJ. Yes. You're in that baseball double. Yes, I'll buy him his lonesome self. Gisela, are you with us? Start you off at number one, but if you have a specific number that you would like us to start at. What's up, What's up, Common? What's going on, my man? Just living life like a camp. We're about to spin this 100 on the gift card wheel. I'm going to guess 79. 79? Hey, that's yeah. I'll take it. Hey. I never guess under 50 because then you put bad energy out there. Yeah, it's true. Giselle says start me off at number 10. Okay, we can do that. Not 16, huh? Uh-uh. She got a new number? I don't know. I guess. All right. Good luck, Gisela. Good luck. That looks like number 10. Well, let's get a little closer. I can't have my eyes are just... I know. I try to get it as close <laughs> <Yeah>. as possible. <laughs> All right. That one looks better. Hey, she said, ha-ha, you remember 16. That's right. Joe Montana. Uh-huh. 49er faithful, of course, Gisela. She's a Niner fan. Okay, not too bad. 51? Not too bad. See? Yeah. That's higher than average. Nice job, Gisela. $51 of Ultimate Autograph gift card money. Use that for a practice squad single. Get yourself a Jalen Hurts custom speed flex for basically for free at that point. Oof. Putting us out of business type deals right now, Con. What's going on? You know, uh, is there a Marino and a different Drew Brees in the practice squad? Uh huh. Marino, authentic Marino. That's too good. We got two Drew. speed flexes, a JJ Watt speed flex. And Colin is going to see Jalen Hurts tonight. I tried to tell him. I was like, guys, you want to get this Jalen Hurts before Colin walks in unless you want drool. Two to go in the next practice yeah. squad double box. Oh, you might get it now. Yeah, basically. you might get it now. <laughs> yeah, hey. I don't want Colin drooling on our helmets. That is true. It's but hey, low. we will get it. Yeah. Nice. We'll get. We'll sign off, get Co uh, Common and Colin ready for the 6 o'clock show, guys. They will be back shortly in 50 minutes. Great show, Robbie. The practice oh, yeah. squad was moving. Thank you. Did an awesome job. As a producer, thank you all for tuning in. Thank you for all playing. We really appreciate it. We'll see you guys back in a few minutes. Have a good Thursday.